Welcome back to the Retro Sports Gamer Channel, and this is Late Night Lumber with Lumber Cracks, Cracks, Lumberjack Cracks, Lumberjack, Lumberjack Cracks, Lumberjack Cracks, and we are playing a super secret sports game. And what does a super secret sports game need? It needs a super secret sports guest for something that I only have a fleeting understanding of. Bare minimal. I mean, I uh, I read it up to the fourth big, the big, the fourth beak. I uh, we're playing Harry Potter Quidditch mm -hmm. World Cup, and you know who has read all the Harry Potter Me. books? Me, Alicia. I've read all of them multiple times so, and seen all the movies multiple times. We bring our super secret special guest here, yes. getting ready. I can do a bloody fantastic. British accent. You don't need to do that the whole time. Not right now, because I'm drunk. You don't have to say that. <laughs> They'll figure that out They'll on their own. They'll figure that out! <laughs> but anyway, neither of us right. have played this game <gasps> in the last 15 years. I've never played it. I have only played this game a couple times. I rented it from Hollywood Video during a time period where I had a free rental every single month. Because we, Tom and I bought the Nintendo Wii. <laughs> I dyed my hair. Uh, I was gonna ask you guys if you if you like the blonde or the dark dark brown better. It looks it looks black. Now she's like a I'm a goth a, a goth girl. girl. I'm super goth. Yeah, I had plastic surgery. Also a uh, Sith Lord. Casual plastic surgery. Yeah. Uh, also, What's, I was wearing glasses last time. Sorry. Go. What is up, Eli? And what is up, OSU? I like your hair better. Thank you! That's awesome. Great. One of my kids was like, you look like a goth girl who really likes death. And I was like, I do really like death. And then I went like this. Like a vampire. And then he ran away, scared. And then he ran away. <laughs> Off yeah, into the away. distance. Yep. Well, so Quidditch is a game that has rules that don't make sense as a sport because the person that invented it doesn't really understand sports. Uh screw it. Yeah. Let's just let's just back up for a second. Quidditch is an amazing game and I really want to play with my kids because it's super fun and when I lived in Boston people were playing it all the time. This is a game that is played <sighs> Alicia, you're married? Why are you dating Matt? Please tell me what's going on. <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm not married. What's up, Adam? Not married. Oh, that's off camera. I'm used to not camera. being. We are all. We are both. In this framing. Can you even see? Yeah, we are anyway, both not married. We need to start getting into uh, this, this bad boy. All right, I'm really excited. I have never played this game before, so I don't know how the controls work. Um. Uh, Matt has. Oh wow! For some reason, it forces me to use the D, D pad, which is uh, interesting. Interesting. We're gonna, we're gonna go to options first. Right. Oh. What's up, Adam? Did I say what's up, Adam? I don't think you did. I, I think I, I, kept, think you, I you meant got to. Distracted. And then you just kept talking. You did. That's my talent. That's what you. What it's you what do. I do. <laughs> so what are you drinking tonight, Alicia? Uh, so I am drinking. I've had a lot of this. Uh, it is a cup filled with Kahlua and Califia. Which is cold brew and oat milk and coconut milk, and it is goddamn delicious. GD delicious. I am gonna be Japan. All right. Well, I'm gonna be. What am I? Ah. Hit the D-pad. You understand? I don't. Oh, know what I'm that selecting is. it. Sorry. <gasps> oh. Okay. I want to be Spain. No, wait. I want to be Australia. Wait. So what are my options? Apparently, Hufflepuff didn't make it. I'm well, so sorry. Well, no, no, no. It's the World Cup, so it's not house teams. Hold on. Then why can I... Oh, because if I because pick the houses... Because you select the houses. Okay, how about we give you a how chance? How about you be Slytherin? So I'll be... I, I've taken the Harry Potter quiz, and apparently I am Slytherin. That makes sense. So uh, we will let you be your team. Alicia just told me you had a kid. <laughs> That's why I was confused. How many... Oh, my kids that I teach! Uh, I do not have a kid. <laughs> I teach. <laughs> Tom says, why? Why, Tom? Because this is a sports game, and it is retro, and I think it will appeal to a certain market. So uh, This is very interesting, what Eli said. There is a cute girl named Lexi in my school, 
And apparently this kid is jealous with me because he thinks I'm dating her when I'm not interested in her. Well. I don't, I don't know. That's, anyway, the, Hufflepuff, yeah. So, no, um, you got to move it over. No, I don't. Oh. You're in control now. I am. Anyway, I'm Hufflepuff. So I haven't you played this tell. game in a very, very long time. Um, I don't remember okay. really yeah. anything about it other than it didn't play well enough for me to think that we should play it. Or that I should buy it. So I didn't buy it. But you know what? It is a sports game and it's time to play it. Um, OSU Rock says, I think Tom is saying, why Matt? Because he's confused that if she was dating behind your back. I have a secret child. What oh, is... great. This is this is helpful. Okay. okay. So are we just, so if, if, should I explain Quidditch? I mean, you can attempt to. We're you gonna... just, I was trying to look at the controls. So, you just No, it, it does it. that on its own. Oh, okay. So basically in Quidditch. Uh, What's there... up, Smoke? Hi. Um, there is one seeker. Their job is to catch the golden snitch. There's only one golden snitch per team. So I'm very confused because there are like five different positions. There's one seeker. There's two beaters who basically hit balls at people to try to knock them off their brooms. There are usually four chasers who are passing. I think it's four. It's three or four chasers who are passing the ball around to try to... You are playing me right now, you little bitch. How do I even play this game? I don't know. It actually controls pretty well right now. What am I... What, uh, what, still, oh, I took the ball. I took so, the ball. Okay, anyway, so I have a chaser right now. A will <gasps> steal the ball. Okay, but how do I catch up to you? Oh, I got it, I got it, I got um, it. I think A will also Why pass the ball. Why do I fly so... And B so, will shoot towards so the goal. So slow. Anyway, so there's a quaffle, which you're trying to get through the hoops. Um, the keepers are the guardians of the hoops. So do I... How do I... What the... Fuck. I mean, I'm figuring it out. Well, that's good for you. You play video games. I do not. Awesome. And I scored. And he scored. So that's 10 points. This game's for actually Slytherin. pretty good. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> wait, wait, don't go yet. I don't know where this guy finds his sports games. <laughs> I don't think it's the Harry Potter thing, Matt, but I could be wrong. I don't know. Who knows? But we are playing right, Harry gone, Potter Quidditch World Cup. How do I? Oh, I just dropped it. Also, interesting that they get to use the name World Cup. Um, Even though it's just the House Cup. No, because World Cup is actually a licensed term by the the FIFA Soccer ah, Association. I dropped it. What the? So, uh, what the fuck is or f whatever the fuck that's. So you only get for. to play as the chaser. It looks like until maybe they release the the snitch later. How do I shoot this? Also, how do B I like, is rise shoot, and fall? A is oh, pass. you didn't explain that. to I me. I did explain that. Ew. Uh, I don't think you did. I mean, so I did, see the golden snitch, or that's not the snitch. No, the what are those? You will what not are those other balls flying those around? Those are uh, what is it called? Why can't I remember what it's called? So there's the quaffle, and then there's the bludgers. So those balls that you see are bludgers. Oh, uh, how do I guard my hoop? Well, your goalkeeper's Ugh. just got to do it. Okay, I'm not even moving. Well, press forward. I Maybe you're. Oh, you're that. the goalkeeper when I score. Oh. So you have to shoot out from that position. Uh, anyway, so... Go get it, go get it, go get it. You and you shot at the hoop where my goalkeeper was. How do I choose what hoop I'm So it to. will glow which one you're but aiming at. how do I aim? With the joystick in the direction that... Uh. It's so, uh, for the people watching, it's like when you're doing a pass in NFL Blitz. It will choose which goal to shoot at. Give it back. Um, anyway, so those are bludgers, and the beaters are trying to knock us off our brooms. Basically, I haven't been seeing any beaters. Just I haven't this seen one anybody ball. but chasers. So I think base, maybe it's like a tutorial. You're beating me like 30 to 0 right now or something. Oh, yeah, you got a high five because you're Slytherin and you're freaking dicks. Fine. Wow. Look at us with our Slytherin dicks out here. Slytherin dicks. You stole the ball. Don't do that. Oh, A is like also to advance, like to go faster, I feel Does like. It? Oh, yeah, maybe. Like to steal it nicely. <laughs> to steal it nicely. To steal it nicely. Ah, yeah, it is the steal me. button. There's only two buttons in this game. It plays like Tecmo. There's an action button and there's a shoot button. Ah, give it back. 
Oh, I see Rock says, sorry, I was distracted by Tom. I'm glad Alicia teaches children and is in I scored! Children and got divorced. <laughs> True. That's what I thought. Or had an affair. I'm acting, acting like I'm, I'm, like I'm sorry. That's okay. I've, I've had a lot to drink tonight, so it actually makes sense to me. Like, your logic seems <laughs> pretty valid. It, uh, it applies to... So, I'm not gonna lie. This game is not is not my favorite. So, so I actually... It controls well. Why is Gryffindor cheering for you? <laughs> that, I, because they're cheering for the wrong squad. They are. They should be cheering for Hufflepuff. Were those actually characters from the book? Uh, they might have been... Well, we might get it's to see them again if I keep scoring on you. Yeah, whatever. I scored once. It's 10 to 50 right now. <laughs> so every time you get it through a hoop, it's 10 points. Uh, and whoever catches the golden snitch gets 150 points and usually will win the game, but sometimes you can get a game where... Stop being a douche. Um, where you can get the snitch but not win the game. So what broom does Harry have? Uh, a Nimbus 2000. No, I mean like Nimbus later. 5, Eventually he gets better brooms. So right? it, the Nimbus uh, is actually a really great broom. Uh -huh. It's super nice. Um, he gets it... Uh, why can't I remember who gets it for him? Uh, basically, I think it's... Sirius gets him the second broom, which is oh, the fire Oh, something's bolt. happening. Oh, they're releasing the snitch. I, think. I don't know. What's happening? Oh. Oh, so now we're the Seekers. Okay, so this is the Trail of the Golden Stitch, and we have to catch it. This is really cool. I like this. Anyway, the Golden Stitch can Suddenly, go Suddenly, we started playing Mario Kart, which we actually intended on playing. We had intended on playing that. And uh, the download, for, I mean, the uh, the delivery for this game. <laughs> I think they were just like, here. Alicia's losing too poorly. So, so now this is your comeback so this chance. This is my comeback chance. I think I got. You were actually it. in front of me, and <gasps> I don't know why. No, you got in front of me. It's I just I'm did that right now. Button slamming A right now. Button slamming. That's a new term that nobody has ever used. Is just really? like double player. Did you catch it? So we are Fuck playing you, double you player in this one, Let's and uh, you actually get it. I'm the the G you man, fell! Draco oh! Malfoy. Oh, you got this it. This is my boy, right That's here. That's Draco. Yeah. So this game came out before Draco was an adult. So he looks like a little boy. Well, he was a little boy. Eli for a says, time. I play the song in the air tonight during my breakups. Play the song in the air tonight yeah. during my breakups. In I can feel it coming in the air tonight. That sounds pretty sweet. OSU Rock says, okay, on to a new subject. How was that NBA jam? <laughs> um, you won. I, I won. I was the best. No, you won this. You didn't win the NBA jam tournament. I was only there briefly. Um, I had an obligation with Alicia that I didn't realize that I needed to attend to. So. <laughs> Alright, play as like, uh, like European team. So I'm going to be Japan. Alright, you are going to be Japan. I'm going to be, am I controlling? I'm you controlling? controlling. Look quickly. Spain. Spain. Why are you picking Spain? Actually, Bulgaria. Well, let me think. Uh, Did Spain ever occupy France? France, uh, Peru? Uh, yeah, of course. Uh, is France an option? Because if I, I always thought that if I did go, yes, France. If I did go to a wizarding school, I would go to Bulbatons. Um, All right, click over to your team. What do I do? So. Okay, so what? Not. Oh, I did it. All right, fantastic. Anyway, so Nimbus 2000, that's what Harry had first. Oh, you can select your broom. N Nimbus 2001, that's the one that came out after 9-11. Um, and there's the <laughs> and fire And you got the fire bolts from Sirius. But so, was there another broom after that? two brooms. Did they stop focusing on Quidditch yes. after... Once he was, like, about to die all the time? Yeah, they stopped focusing on Quidditch. Because... Basically, the fourth book, he continued playing, but the fourth book was really when they... The Quidditch well, was... Well, the, gob the Goblet of Fire was the, the thing that happened, like, every four years or something, right? Goblet of Fire... Uh, so the Triwizard Tournament happens every... Why can't it? I remember. It doesn't. Ha it's like every 50. It's not very frequent. It does not happen very frequently. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong. So somebody, if you know when the ch how often the Triwizard Tournament happens, <laughs> please let me know. We'll see if somebody does. You could also Google it. I never started the tournament. I just. He didn't even start. Yeah. So, you know. 
I could beat Tom. To it's fine. It's fine. Sometimes taking a break from dating is helpful. Tom went and won the original NBA Jam tournament. Glad I'm not dating so I can do that kind of stuff. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's not yeah there you I go mean, eli that's why you take a break from dating. that's why you take a break from dating so you can do crap I'm trying to figure out where we are right now i think we're how did in we, france how did uh streaming harry potter turn into dating advice I have no idea. why are there pumpkins flying around can you explain it's that halloween. to me why is it halloween uh is this the beginning of the third book no this is not the beginning of the third book the third book begins with Harry learning... Oh, the fourth book starts at a Quidditch match, right? I don't believe so. One of them starts at a Quidditch match, because I read up to the fourth book. Uh, the second book starts... The second book starts with them stealing the car. The... Am I yellow or blue? You're blue. I'm blue! I'm winning! Well, not when you shoot, not at, when I shoot the wrong right goal. at the wrong goal. I don't know why Japan is yellow. Oh, is blue, oh, 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 come on. Seriously? Yellow? No, that's not what they mean. It's that's, like orange. No, Harry Potter. No, 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 no. The English. Uh, but you guys have cool things. anime hair. Nimbus 2002, where's that one? Nimbus 2002? There is no Nimbus 2002, I believe. I don't think he gets the, he gets the Nimbus 2000 and then he gets the Firebolt. And um, that's about it. He gets the fireball from Sirius after his broom is crushed by the Whomping Willow. Oh, so sad. It is really sad. It's a sad moment. I remember that moment. Um, that happens in the second book when they steal the car. No, sorry. His bro Sorry. I'm misspeaking. His broom gets crushed by the Whomping Willow in the third book. When I cannot talk and play video games at the same it's time. It's fine. This, is really this game is actually pretty hard to follow. It, it plays is. well because there's only two buttons. Uh, um, but anyway, during the third book, he is... Oh, am I going to score? Oh, you keep shooting at the goal I can't that see the, where the, goal. the defender's I can't at. See, I can't see anything right now. Um, <laughs> I'm not even going I've been wearing my contacts too much. Uh, so... During the third book, he's at a Quidditch match, and Dementors start attacking. Uh, he goes after the Golden Snitch. Dementors start attacking. He faints. Oh, I remember and this. And his broom falls into the Whomping Willow. That was shit. That shit was hype. It was hype. <laughs> uh, so, but during the third book is when we get introduced to Sirius Black, his godfather, and um serious gets him in a broom because that's can i guard these is that a thing um i don't know if you can play goalie okay anyway so serious gets him a new broom and it's the fireball and it's really sweet of him you and just threw the ball to me i didn't mean to i feel like i'm going too slow i have to pass uh a doesn't make you go faster so I stop know. hitting a <laughs> To pass so it. I figured out. Take it from me. Back to the uh, what's happening in the game. I figured out um, that bar at the top where you see the two ends of the snitch when mm -hmm. they meet each other. That's when the golden snitch part of Is the game released? happens. Mm -hmm. And then that's when we do the chase. I the the thing that I don't understand is because that means that you win the game, right? Well, it's, if you were beating me, like, 200 to 50, basically, if I caught the snitch, I mean, retire. if you were beating me, <laughs> like, 190 to 50, if I caught the snitch, I would win. Got it. So even if you had gotten 19 goals, basically, is one way to think of it, um, I would still win. Eli says he read up to five. Wow, not a lot of Harry Potter fans in this. Bitch, I was about to score! Hey, we got one. I was thinking nobody would watch, would have seen or played Harry. Red. <laughs> Red? Played? There, there are actually Harry Potter games. Um, I want to say I, there all the way up to the Lego end of the Harry series. No, they're the early ones. They're, so there is, there is Sorcerer's games. Stone, there's right. Chamber of Secrets. Um, I don't know if they did Prisoner of Azkaban, though. I think after the first two, they might have stopped. 
But there is Quidditch in those games too. Oh, fun. But they actually broke this out into its own game. And it's not as bad as I thought it was going to be. Oh. It's hard though. Like, it's really well, hard. Well, it's because I'm on top like. of you every time. You, you keep throwing and at I keep the goalie. Throwing at the goalie yeah. That is correct. Also, I have no idea where Eli I'm says aiming. that he Very is a Harry Potter fan. That. Nice, Eli. Very glad to hear it. I've been wanting to reread the books because, as you can see, um, I have forgotten a few things. I really sad because it's <laughs> a wonderful, wonderful series. I was in second grade when uh, Harry Potter came out, so it was like the prime age for me. Well, fun fact, my brother read all the books and I pretended to read them because I wanted to be cool like he was. So Off when you mean pretending me. reading, did you so just flip pages? So I would like pages? flip through them when, until I was like 10. I did not read books. Ah, oh, why did I do that again? Uh, basically, until I was 10, I did not read books like at all. And um, I did not read, start reading the Harry Potter books until the fifth one came out, and then I started reading all of them. So I think the fifth one came out like when I was 10, actually. Um, so that's when I started reading books. So. Like the Mouse series, do you remember those? Yeah. Um, I did not actually read those books. So, uh, what is it called? It's by Beverly Clary. Totally. Um, I re not she made the Ramona books. Uh, what was it? The Mouse and the Motorcycle, right? Is that no, what you're talking about? No, not the Mouse and the Motorcycle. Like the Mouse War books. Oh, Redwall? Yes, Redwall. So I never read Redwall. There was a cartoon on uh, PBS that I had seen it a couple times. And mm -hmm. I was like, oh, this is so cool. Like animals acting like like, humans. like people. Yeah, it's very This cool. is amazing. And then... It would happen like in the middle of the night. I scored. A so goal. I didn't really get to watch it very much, but I it wish wasn't, I could was see it more. Was it a series? Was that a thing? Yeah, it's a series of books, Tom's and it's an animated series. <laughs> wow. Got to be cool when he does whatever he wants. Yeah, you know you gotta you gotta mm -hmm. find that. Mm -hmm. It's okay. I'm winning. You scored actually, and I you, did score. you ignored the no, fact that you scored. No, I didn't. I said I scored. Oh, I thought you were just singing High School Musical again. <laughs> if I could go back and change the past, yeah, seriously. Zootopia, Nick Wild, ooh. -woo. I also feel like I'm getting insulted in the chat a little bit right now. But don't <laughs> It's fine. I'm opening up a cider. Let's see if you can score while I'm not drunk enough not to not care. You are play. You're not playing, so you can automatically take the ball from someone. I feel like the clock like Yeah, I mean, if you press A someone. next to somebody, you take it. I'm you're you're sure. learning now how to actually shoot a goal. I am. You have to press A. Yup. Oh, oh, sorry. Did you score again? No, I almost did. Oh, yikes. Oh, they're going to release oh. the snitch. So I'm only up a little bit, so that shouldn't give me much of an advantage in this one. Nope. I can't tell which one I am, though. Oh, I'm on the bottom, aren't I? Have a good one, OSU. Thank you for stopping Thanks in. Thanks for tuning in. Glad you could stay up for this super secret sports game. Super Secret Sports Game is also alliteration, which sounds Super great. Super Secret Sports Game. Why am I so far behind you? No, I don't even know what we're together, supposed to be together, doing together. here. Are we just supposed to stay in the path and whoever stays no in the path the most clue. gets the snitch? Because that's what it feels feel like. a lot of vibration, and also I'm just pressing A a lot, and I don't know what that means. Yeah, I'm not even... I'm pressing A2, and I don't know if that does anything. I think it's like you reach out when you're pressing A. I'm so close. My, Come on, just reach it. Die for it, bitch. You're in front of me, and my bar is full, so I don't know what that means. I think it means I'm supposed to stay in the path longer, and then you're going to shoot up in front of me. 
So like when you get when your bar is full, I feel like you oh, get so to the snatch. Oh, so that builds your boost? Maybe. No, it does. And then A uses your boost. So now I have full boost, and now I can just hold down A. Oh, I ran out of boost. Get away from me! Oh, oh, oh! No! No! Come on, Japan! Come on, France! Oh! Go Sportsball Gaming says I used to love this game when I was a kid. The only no problem way. was that the computer was too easy to beat, and I rarely had anyone to play with. Yeah, I mean, I only played this when I rented it, and then I never played it after that, and it didn't Neither leave a, a big impression. Um, Because it, it was a game I was considering on buying, and at the time I would rent games before I would buy them. Because I had free rentals, so... Get away from me. Press B. Oh, what did that do? You could have won the whole time. <laughs> I B didn't know... is what actually grabs I, it? Yeah, I didn't know there was the capture button. Wow. Okay, so here's the thing. <laughs> I'm going to bed, Matt. I'm not myself right now. Sorry if I've been out in front of your girlfriend. <laughs> So you won. I won. Okay, so here's the thing about girlfriends. Uh, <laughs> oh, wow. Here we go. We're having this talk right I now. mean, I just, like, when you're in a relationship, you need to understand that sometimes you have to compromise on stuff. Like, that's how that works. Uh, so, like, you can't expect your girlfriend to compromise on everything. Like, that's not cool. Matt, which Zelda games do you like the most? Which Zelda games do I like the most? Oh, you unlock more special moves. Starting out, you only get a few things, but you do unlock things like special moves, bludgers, and combos when you play so through the Hogwarts mode. The... So that makes oh, sense. Oh, interesting. So we're playing like the base version of the game then. Um, so I guess we look at the inventory. So that's what this special list moves. special moves, volley one. And locked. We so need all six we can cards. do right now is volley. What's a rem? A remember rem all is a ball that tells you when you forget something, and it glows red when you forget something. Is but that a you, part of the game? It doesn't tell you what you've forgotten. I don't Wait, know. Wait, what? It tells you when you forgot it something, but it won't tell you. It just tells you that you've you? forgotten something, but it won't tell you what you've forgotten. So like Neville's that thing like, would be... but I can't forget, or I can't remember what I've forgotten. You know? But that thing it's would really be lighting bad. up like a Christmas There's tree no for British me constantly. In I don't know. Someone might be British in the chat. Who Ugh. knows? By the way, before I go to bed, to I am trying to find the most oh, perfect goodness. arcade games to port onto the arcade cabinet. Matt, do you know any of offhand? Um, it depends on what you mean by sports or by uh, arcade games. Uh, it, if you're going to talk about arcade games as far as sports go, you know Blitz Showtime. Those are the ones that I would recommend. Wayne Gretzky 3D Hockey is also a arcade cabinet and a fantastic game, so that's one that you should check out. Um, yeah. So, yeah, why would I need that? I'm always forgetting things. It's a joke. It's funny. It's like, it's funny. All right. Well, it's a pretty good joke. You want to wanna even out this. Uh, so we're both one and one. Mm-hmm. I think you finally have understood how to I play this game. Understand. So, do you want to? I want to be Hufflepuff. So Let's I'm gonna I'm gonna roll with Gryffindor, All and right. you can be Hufflepuff, I'm be Hufflepuff again Hufflepuff. and avenge that's my them. My team. That's my that's my house. <laughs> yeah, man. I mean, oh, Matt's I've... video game career. It's it's <laughs> it's just starting off, man. It's just starting. <laughs> Versus. Got a little little jump start from the Retro Sports Gaming Channel. Yep. Um, it's great. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Make sure to give this a like and a share. I know I'm going to share it on my Facebook because uh, that's what all the cool kids are doing. So. Eli is buying a tux and a velvet. What's a velvet? A vet? A vet? I don't know what a vet is. Is that a vest? Adam, oh, I haven't responded. My favorite, favorite is game. linked to the past. Um. My favorite Zelda game is probably Breath of the Wild. 
Breath of the Wild. Um, Who wants to see? Okay, you gotta. I mean, me I know who's gonna win this. Doing this. Okay, you do um, your thing. But I, I and then uh, Ocarina of Time. And then uh, it's going to be the original Zelda, because those are the ones I've played <laughs> all the way through. Oh, that is a Corvette. Oh, yeah. You know, just get a Corvette. People love that shit. Talks on a Corvette. Anyway, so my question is, and I think I know who's going to win this, but write in the chat uh, if you would like to see Matt play Breath of the Wild me play Breath of the Wild, and I have to tell you, I fall off a lot of things and catch on fire a lot. Or a side-by-side -side comparison of Breath of the Wild. You're not doing a very good explanation of this, because we are not on my channel, we're on Tom's channel. Oh, right, right on Matt's channel. <laughs> Relationships in my opinion are second to video games. Don't worry, I haven't had a girlfriend yet, so the balance of the world is not out of order. You know, if yeah. that's where your priorities are, that's where they are. I can respect that. Yep. Never going to tell you that's a bad idea. So we're going to do Hogwarts in the winter since we did the summer Hogwarts last time. Hogwarts in the winter. Shoot. So Action. So does anything Crimson. change when they play in the winter? Do they have to wear bigger coats? No. No. Do they not worry about the temperatures? They don't worry about the temperatures. Girls James Bond's is getting... <laughs> You're getting roasted I am tonight. getting roasted on this channel tonight. <laughs> I have to post on my own channel. Games are more fun. <laughs> Games are more... Hmm... Not sure I'd agree with that, but you know. Well, whatever. I'm not going to say anything because that just sounds down. arrogant. and Whatever. Uh, Get out the way. Move, bitch. Get, Get out, out the, the way. way. Get, Get out, out the way, way bitch. Get, Get out the way. way. <laughs> Nobody can. I is there that I can pass to. Yeah, you were just leading I the was, pack on that I one. I was alone. So this is your third game playing this. Do you actually feel like you have an understanding? A of little it? bit. I feel like it's my third game playing. Like like how I felt on my third game playing Tecmo, Tecmo which I lost because I'm just not used to it yet. Like I'm just so not used to it at all. Well, I scored though. No, I didn't score. Did I? Oh yes, I did. I just did a back handspring on my broom. I just don't understand how we got to the girlfriend talk. I don't either. <laughs> I feel like it's a bad audience. Like you guys should talk about this one. <laughs> bad audience? Wow. Like no, 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 no. Like bad at having me in the audience oh, gotcha. of the talk. You're not the audience though. I guess so. You're the, the co-host. I'm the co-host. For Late Night with Lumberjack Cracks, which you're currently watching, I know everybody that's currently watching yep. is subscribed to the Lumberjack Cracks channel. But, but if not, subscribe. If not, subscribe to the Lumberjack Cracks channel for non-sports games. Like and share. And if you're like, hey, Matt, this is not a sports game, you're like, no, you're wrong. This is a fake sports game, which is still a sports game. And this is definitely retro. This is definitely also a sports game because Quidditch is a sport and people play it. It is a sport that is played by college students mm -hmm. who do stick brooms between their legs yep. and do run around in great. fields. And somebody dresses up like the golden snitch and tries to run and as fast as they can away. And fuck around. <laughs> and it's amazing. Matt, you um, gotta read the comments so I can score. Because I want to know. No, I'm trying can. to score right now. Well, you're not going to. Sorry. Oh, yikes. Did anybody vote Matt playing Zelda on his channel, me playing Zelda on I his channel? They're talking about or girlfriends. both of us playing Zelda on his channel. I've been through. Give through. it a vote. We should just be doing a, a love line thing instead. We should. All right. I'll give, I'll give some advice. <laughs> Eli Wait, says I've see. been Hold through. Hold up. Don't do anything. No, we're in the middle of a game, what? Alicia. You can't just stop. Yes, you can. I've been through four girlfriends. Last year, it was sad and depressing when I got my heart broken just because I wouldn't give up everything, even YouTube. Aw. Well, that's not good. You will still get what you want as a woman, Alicia, and I understand as a woman you want... By your man, by yourself. Don't be upset. Matt will always be there for you. Oh, that's so true. Thank you. Stick to your hobbies, bro. Stick to your hobbies. A girl will never love you like your mother. JC Jones says, fuck it. More people should swear. By the way, Alicia, I hope you don't swear in front of children. I don't. I don't swear in front of children. That's not a thing. Too many children. That is very true. So many of my kids swear and like 10 year olds, like 10 year olds are swearing. And I'm just like, no, I, I agree words. with JC Jones. 
Words are meaningless. Actions speak louder than words. Oh, um, just swear as much as you want. Fuck it. Yeah, Who I don't cares? swear in front of my kids, though, because that's inappropriate. No, I mean, you're an adult. You shouldn't do that. But kids, if they're swearing, they're swearing. What am I? Yeah, I mean, I'm not going to control them. Like, that's fine. But uh, what am I I mean, you have sworn two kids to relate to them, though. You've said that. Well, one time this girl was really upset, and I was like, you know, your whole life people are going to make fun James. of you because you're talented. And I was like, and you know what you got to say? You just got to just gotta say fuck them. And she related so hard to that because she's in sixth grade. So, like, it's, I feel like once you get to sixth grade and your teachers use swears appropriately and not against you, like, not... Like, oh, you're a fucking Not dumb like, shit, oh, fuck you. You know, like, you can't do that. Um, but... Words are spells. They have power, says James Bond. Society's decaying. Words are spells. They have power. That's true. I find it's weird how uh, much children believe whatever you say, and that gives you a lot of power, and it's really scary. Uh, today I went to this training, and I didn't really learn anything. But basically, the one thing I learned that I already knew was don't be mean to children because it will hurt their feelings and they will take it personally. And snitch time. Uh, they will take it personally and you will traumatize them. Like 100%. So I got Harry Plopper in this situation. There's no way them. to be. Uh, sorry, but Cedric Degree is getting the. Cedric Degree, these nuts. Snitch. I'm Harry Plopper, boy. Sorry, but I'm catching up to you. Get out of here. Get out of here. I'm gonna win get this. Get off! Get off! Get off! Get off! Get off! Oh, 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 Harry Plopper! Oh! <laughs> no! Yes! I win the best oh, two God. out of three series. Do. do you want to continue going? We could do three out of five. Eli, I'm so sorry you lost a lot of friends. Um... Wow, look at him. He's cold. Uh, relationships, like toxic relationships are definitely, they can cause you to lose friends and really regret being in them. So I'm sorry that that happened to you. What do you think? More Harry Potter? Mario Kart? No, I'm asking you. We're, uh. What are our options? We could do best three out of five. Mm, I don't know about that. So you want, you're, you're satisfied with your one victory mm -hmm. over me. Cool with that. And, uh, we're going <coughs> to. We're gonna finish this one out. How about, how about we just uh, we don't end the stream and we just start playing Mario Kart because it's right here. Mario Kart, it is. It is right there. All right, so that was uh, Harry Potter. Harry Potter. Um, World Cup. There you go. Yep. She said the words. It did it? Says it right there. Took them right. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Took them right out of my mouth. My controller. Because. <laughs> Your God, I can't even read right now. That's, Girlfriends, Eli, your rough. fault. Yeah, so I have this thing where I, when I wear my contacts too much, I like can't see small text. Um, I'm gonna approve this comment because I like it. It says, "Bros before hoes." That's that's what's up, yo. Yeah. Uh, having dated a lot of hoes. <laughs> Kidding. Uh, I would say bros are the way to go, but you know, what would you say, Matt? You know, I, I choose to remain. You choose the hoe. Neutral. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I really like this like dating advice. Not even dating advice, but dating talk that's happening. James, I abs definitely agree. Bros forever. Matt, would you say we're bros? I'd say we're bros. We're broing out right We're now. Broing out right now. This is this is a broy moment. It is a broy moment. We're gonna play Mario Kart. Give her a promise ring. That's very sweet. That's cute. So Eli, when I was in high school, oh god, I had no girlfriends. You didn't have any girlfriends. Do they? Do Just, you want to tell them how many people you've dated? I mean, I dating. Like, but like, how many girlfriends? Do I don't you know have? how many I've dated. Yeah, but how many girlfriends you've had? No, why are we talking about this? I don't know, because you brought it up. Get out of here. Get. Good idea. 
Yeah, Mario Kart 64! Yes. So, so we're gonna play 50cc because Alicia probably doesn't want to play on 150cc. I want to play. Alright, so I'm gonna be Peach right now, but uh, I'm probably gonna be Peach for the rest of the night because she goes like this, and it's really so cute, and I, I dropped my controller again. <laughs> Um, I'm gonna play as Bowser because if you noticed, we have the Jap drunk. the Japanese only sprites of uh, the original Mario Kart, where uh, Peach and Bowser are chugging their champagne after winning. It's pretty great. And uh, Bowser is me. And I am Peach. And, and Alicia is Peach. One time I auditioned to be Daisy, and I didn't get it. But uh, I've always felt a connection towards her. <laughs> After that? <laughs> After that. You did enough research. Thank you, sweetheart. Matt is lucky to have you. He is lucky to have me. But I'm lucky to have him. I think I'm more lucky to have him than he is to have me. Can we do Special Cup? You're not ready for wanna, Special Cup, girl. I want to be girl. special. We're going to do right, Mushroom it. Cup because I think that's what you're ready Can for. Can we do Calamari? It does. We're doing Calamari? the whole cup. Oh. We're doing the whole cup. All right. So I, I just learned how to play this game. Oh, read that comment while I'm doing this. Sure. I will win the race anyway. Um, Eli, <laughs> check out Face in LMS for the brutal truth of where you really stand with women. Watch it. His blah. Why are there other people I thought it was just going to be us. Um, because that's how this works. Well, I'm in third. Great. I'm in eighth. Yep. And you're super far behind. That's fine. Anyway, I do think that I am luckier to have Matt than he is to have me. That's I would definitely that's very, that. very nice. <laughs> you try? I, try. Did, I think you just stole that from me. That's my... That's I try? My... I say I try all the mm, time. No, I think that's my catchphrase. Uh, I don't think so. Mm, I think mm, your catchphrase... Uh, catchphrase... <laughs> <laughs> Your catchphrase. If you go back to <laughs> streams on here, people will tell me that I'm doing a good job, and I say I I try, I try the best I, I can. I say I try all the time, but um, I think your catchphrase uh, uh, is. I don't even know what your catchphrase is. You don't really. Catchphrase. Catchphrase. Detroit basketball. That's your catchphrase. Yep, I mean, that's, catchphrase. that's one of them. <laughs> Actually, my earliest catchphrase on this channel and. Um, Nobody watching would have watched this. Was uh, I'm I'm so excited for this. I'm so excited. Was and it was always sarcastic because I would play, I'd stream something or oh, play something fuck. with Tom, and I'm like, I'm so excited, and it never sound genuine. How are you in second place? I'm in first. How are you in first place? Because I'm Bowser, baby. All right, we gotta play like Smash or something. Oh, wow. We're getting... Because, you know, I'm going to win that. Definitely. You're going to get smashed here up in this B. I'm going to get smashed up in this Detroit basketball. Detroit basketball. Basketball. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I would say my catchphrase is, my name is Lista, and I have to pee. That's pretty much what I say <laughs> most of the time. Oh, wow. I didn't realize that became your catchphrase. So. Well, it's just, like, the thing that I say the most, I feel like. Or I rhyme with Alista. Because yeah. Matt calls me Alista, and I call him Matto. Oh, man. We're getting we're, we're getting, getting way too cute on this stream. We're getting real cute on this stream. You don't have to air uh, out our dirty laundry. It's not dirty laundry. It makes sense, because I said my name is Alista, and I have to pee stuff. It's pretty much what I spend most of my time doing. Yes! Saying. Sorry, I shouldn't be swearing so much. Why am I? It's okay. I'm just swearing and a lot And you're also today. from New Jersey, so. From New Jersey, know. so you have to forgive me. You know who also is from New Jersey? Who? Eli the Wolf. So, Eli, I thought we had a connection. Eli has some advice for you. Most women are hard to date in general. For example, celebrities, in my opinion, are the average girl... And they are high maintenance and want a lot from a man. It's them, not you. Um, mm. You're looking for the wrong people, us, yo. That's all I'm going to say on that. Otherwise, with time, you'll get over women. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> when you get over women. What the fuck what? happened here in this chat? Why is <laughs> We got 10 people watching. We're doing Love Line doing with love Dr. Line. Drew right now. 
Yeah, just Doctor tell Synchronized us, Drink. Tell us our tell us your relationship problems. Yeah, we'll, we'll give you advice. We'll give you advice. I would say most people are hard to date, date in general, not just women. Uh, it is hard spending a lot of time with someone and go and um, like still liking them. Really? Oh, his first girlfriend was from Maryland. I am from Maryland. Okay, so I'm from a lot of places. You've heard I'm from New Jersey. I'm from Maryland. I'm from Vermont. Uh, I have moved around a lot. Honestly, I always say that you're from Jersey. Yeah, it's more, it's funner. It's the m one with the most but personality. You're, you're from all of the East Coast. I'm in basically, my I have moved all over the East Coast above Maryland. Oh, I just knocked some no, people Bo out. Boston's the highest, right? Boston? No, Vermont is the highest. Vermont's higher than Boston? Vermont is in New England, so yes, it is higher than Boston. What? I just ran straight into Vermont. I thought Vermont something. was down by Maryland. Are you kidding? I don't know what the. You know, Vermont I, is in New England. Dude, I don't care about the East Coast. I think that's so weird because I don't care about the Midwest. <laughs> I'm just like, the Midwest? Who lives out there? You Apparently live I here. do. <laughs> and it's weird. Well, like, I don't live in the Midwest. That's not a thing. You know, I can't change your opinion about that. Midwest is what it is. Uh, Chicago's okay. This is as good as it gets in the Midwest. Yeah, it's kind of sad, right? I mean, like, I don't know. Eli says, hey, really? I was born and raised in Jersey. Where in Jersey, Eli? I was born, well, I was born in Glen Ridge, and I was, um, lived in Montclair for two years. Your family's from Hackensack, My though, family right? is from Hackensack and Wyckoff. 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 Wyckoff, New Jersey. Yeah. It's a. Uh, Wyckoff is actually, they don't talk like that there. So. Mm. Although I guess my grandmother does talk like that. <laughs> Your grandmother so, lives there she and she totally talks like talks that. She totally talks like so. that. Let's be real. Oh, God. There's so many comments that I haven't read yet. Oh, no. I all apologize. Right, after this race, we're going to catch up on all the comments. Matt is falling J behind. JC Jones says, hey, LJC, I was. Oh, well, that was the wrong one. <laughs> JC Jones says, yeah, I talked to a girl once. We totally had sex. Nice. That's good. That's good for you, JC Jones. That's, uh... I don't know if you got the sarcastic read on that. I but... did. Okay, that was a good, good read. Right, thank it was you. good. It was really good. That's... Oh, I almost won. Oh, no, there's one more lap. No, that's it. <sighs> I was so close, and then I just got beasted in the last second. Okay, let me see these. They can be tough. For example, to if you if I wanted to date Taylor Swift, she would demand me to do everything 24/7 and treat her like a queen. That's the average female. Too high maintenance. I think you should treat your woman like a queen all the time. I don't uh, know if that's really. My first GF from Swiss Maryland, and then I had a panic attack when statement. she broke up with me. That is that is very relatable. Um. I've been with probably a hundred women, Eli. I think... I've learned the juice ain't worth the squeeze. <gasps> Lizzo reference. Uh, I love Lizzo, but the juice is probably worth the squeeze. Hobbies are way better. <laughs> trust me. Um. <laughs> also, you shouldn't treat people like kings and queens. You should treat them like people. treat them like people. It's Chill true. out with that. Well, he said like that's a bad thing, but like treating someone like. Like a nice person, I don't know. Roderick Coleman, what's up? I don't think I've read your name in the chat before. Y'all friends or dating? We're we are dating. We are dating, yep. and we're also racing currently. I treat everyone like a king treats peasants. See, your controller wasn't vibrating because we were playing the sixty-four and it doesn't have that function. I also have to pee. <laughs> well, we're in the last oh, race. Oh, I'm drowning! I'm drowning! I'm drowning! I'm drowning! We're in the last race of this cups. Oh, no, we're in the second to last race. We're in Sorry. We're the last race. We're not even close to the last race. It's fine. There's, You're going to have to wait like six minutes. <laughs> I can't. I'm just going to win. So You're going to win. I'm in the water. I stepped on a banana peel. Anyway, so. JC Jones says, I treat everybody like a king treats I peasants. I already read that. Oh. <laughs> Yikes. Yikes. Oh, what's this? What's this? Oh, I missed it. Oh, no. I was <laughs> trying to get you to race, so. 
I'm all the way in eighth place. You're in sixth place. So wow. You're not too bad. Nah, you should feel like yeah. it. You should feel like Toad getting blasted by a red shell. Today I put a mushroom on my head and said it was Toad. <laughs> <laughs> that did happen in Target. <laughs> Roger Coleman says, how long you all been dating? What is both of y'all's favorite GameCube games? Oh, God. Um, so, I'm Alicia sorry. has literally only played one GameCube My game. My favorite and it GameCube was... game is Harry Potter. <laughs> uh, uh, Quidditch, Quidditch World, World Cup. Cup. I just um, shot a mushroom. My favorite a... GameCube oh. game. Um, if you're going to ask me that question right now, I'm going to give you the answer that I don't know if it's 100% true, but I'm going to say Luigi's Mansion. Oh. Uh, it was the first game that I actually got on the GameCube, and I'm a huge fan of the Resident Evil series, and it was basically a beautiful marriage between uh, Ghostbusters and Resident Evil and Mario, and I thought it was a fantastic game. And, um, you know, it can't be matched. My favorite GameCube game? No, my favorite game is probably King of Hearts. If we're, if we're talking about that. You've you've only played like about five played games like at this point. <laughs> so. Uh, Pokemon, Kingdom Hearts. That's right. You've also al allegedly have played uh, Link's Awakening on the Game Boy. We're Ocarina of Time. I can't decide which one. That was a 64 game, so you okay, would have played so it on with the then. controller that we're holding. Did not do that. Okay, I so you played... played a Zelda game. Why yeah. did I sound moving? A Zelda game on the Game Boy Color. Uh, OSU Rock says JC Bowser does look like a turtle. Yeah. Are we talking about Bowser Jr.? I don't know. I think he was just responding to Jace. Oh. Oh, JC Jones says, "Is this a sport? Do they let turtles drive now?" <laughs> I wish I was a turtle. Um, do they have cookies outside now? Can I go through this tunnel? Um, yeah, you can, but you have to be good. Well, fuck you. <laughs> that was so mean. <laughs> you can do this, but you have to be better than you are. <laughs> well, now you're in eighth place. You also need to use your star now because. Yeah. All right, a lot of comments going on here. Read them while I catch up. Roderick Coleman says, your girlfriend needs to play more GameCube games. I it's agree. True. I do. Um, one that Game I, people. both of us need to play is the, uh... That's a Yep. We both need to play is, um... What is one that we both need to play? Zelda Wind Waker. I was born in Livingston. What county is that in? I don't know. Livingston? How long have we been dating? Have we... We didn't answer that. Do you want to answer that, Matt? I thought... Almost a year. Almost a year. A year months. and less than a month. I, though, want to meet Taylor Swift even though she has high maintenance. I don't know if we can judge Taylor Swift from not knowing her. She might DP. be super low maintenance. DPS joins the chat and says, A girl? How can this be? I know. Open your eyes yeah. and maybe you'll see. Girlfriend should let him play at the NBA tournament. <laughs> JC Jones says Super Monkey Ball. We can play that if you want to. We can play whatever you want. You know what? Let's. We got oh, one OSU more. Rocks. I wonder what celebrity would be attracted to me if I was famous. No idea. Eli has a fantasy girlfriend, and her name is Crystal. That's uh, it's it's from Star Fox. She's a fox. A fox. A foxy fox. DPS uh, just drove home from Green Bay. Work at 7 a.m. Oh. DPS, why do you always work at 7? That's just brutal. That's so bad. And on how did, Sunday? How did you do, Dan? Did you did did you do well in the tournament? <laughs> OSU Rocks is asking to play NBA Jam. I don't think we're going to get around to that tonight. We can play Tecmo. Um, I don't know how to play I beat Jace at Tecmo. JC Jones, I beat him at Tecmo. He's in the chat. He you, is in the chat. You can also watch that here on the Retro Sports you Gamer can. channel at the family 
tournament. It's uh, but I beat him, and it was the JC only Jones time I've says ever won. Super Monkey Ball is pretty much a sports game. It's got balls, just like balls, balls 3D. It's got balls. <laughs> it's got balls. It's got balls. <laughs> we ain't afraid of balls here. Why am I always in eighth place? <laughs> Three and one in group play. I was eighth seed, made it to Sweet 16, but lost two in a row. Well, eighth place is the last place, so I understand that's that, why. Yeah. That's why you're always in eighth People place. are just here to watch you win and watch me get wrecked. Well, I'm not actually winning in this one currently because no. I haven't been paying attention. I'm trying to read the chat. I'm trying to read the chat. But we're also playing on 50 CC, so I'm pretty sure I'll catch up and win the race at the end. So. Mm. What? 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 Why did I just like explode? Everybody. I thought I had a box. Dude, my vision is so blurry right now. No, oh, you should probably go to bed. <laughs> I've been drinking coffee and Kahlua. So DPS says everybody just acts funny in chat because Elise is here. You guys are crazy. <laughs> DPS, you and Mort are like the only people who defend me ever. I saw one time you guys were super nice to me in Demon Tap stream, and I was like, yeah. This is great. Uh, and everybody else is just like, girls suck. You know? So, um, yeah, I don't know what to think about that. <laughs> well, to be fair, I think JC Jones is also defending you. He just he's answers everything in sarcastic. So, he's on my know. he's on my side. I think he's on your side. Even though you beat him in the Even family though I tournament beat him, and shamed him publicly. Shamed in front him. Of Everybody should watch that game because I'm very gamer. proud of it. It actually kicks I'm off the stream. All the way in the sand. Oh. So if you guys haven't watched that, and JC Jones says, yeah, girls are gross. <laughs> <laughs> they are, but they're not as gross as boys. That's not, that's not, that's not really true. Oh, boys are pretty gross. Boys mm. are pretty awful. Mm. Ooh, lightning. I just hit you with lightning and shrunk you. Right? I shrunk you? Uh, yeah, you shrunk everybody in front of you. That's how that power-up works. Thank you for explaining. <laughs> Condescendingly <laughs> to me. You're welcome. Thank you. I like that we're in the desert. You're welcome. What can I say? Except I'm going the wrong you're way. Welcome. I was just going backwards for a second. Uh, I love Disney movies, and so does Matt. You're welcome. You're welcome. Um, should we do an Ali Matt song? <laughs> I we'll see we'll maybe, see what happens maybe, maybe, maybe you could play your original at the end of the stream oh god I hate that original I wrote this one song to a guitar part that Matt really likes because he came up with it it's just his favorite song of mine it's and not my favorite it's just that I'm not good enough to come up with music for the ones that you that like I like more. So he likes us to play. DPS says Alicia rocking back and forth while constantly. Or while Am I <laughs> truly amazing. And then Alicia rocks asks DPS, are you flirting with Alicia? Yes. I <laughs> meant <deep> her character. <laughs> <laughs> I take my girl out for a cruise on the road. Yeah. What is y'all favorite Disney movie, movie of all time? Oh, man. Do you have um, an answer? I'm going to be completely honest on this one. Frozen, Moana, Tangled, not Tangled. Aladdin, the it's new Aladdin? Currently, the way if you're going to talk Disney animated movies. Disney animated. That's what we're okay. going to we're going to set it King. down to. Honestly, I think it's going to have made? to be Frozen. Frozen! Cuz Frozen is I love Frozen. So good. <laughs> so good. Um, no, and I'm against and then, Disney. But Not like, princess on a straight away, like moving left and right. So funny, lol. What? After that, it's probably gonna have to be. Uh, Let me see. Have I seen Balto? I have not. That's the new Disney original, right? No. So Balto was actually a uh, non-Disney movie that was made in the past. No, but there's a new. There's a new Balto Disney I series. Um, but yeah, uh, my second place for the Disney animated movie is actually going to be Moana, but that's mostly due to my oh. niece, so. She's just, she loves Moana. Uh, I would but say But honestly, Moana. I think I might like the music better for Moana. Than Fro but Frozen 2? You gotta count Frozen 2 in there. No, I'm not, they're not the same movie. 
And Frozen 2 is not better than Frozen 1. I would say my favorite is probably Tangled. Um, after that, wait, Frozen. You see that castle? Mm -hmm. You recognize it? I do. Do you also recognize who's on top? Peach. No. What? No. On top That's of the podium. Peach. Bowser. This guy won. Uh, oh, that one is Togo. You're so right. Uh, I have never seen the movie Balto. I read about Balto, I feel like, as of when I was little. Um, did you like the Aladdin live action soundtrack? Someone played some of the songs on the jukebox and I hated it. I usually love Disney tunes. Jace, I love the Aladdin live action soundtrack. And so does Matt. Actually, yeah, the Aladdin live... So, so you need to actually watch it. Because the choreography that goes along it's with just, it's the music, it's so good. Mind blowing. Um, the the cast, like they're just so talented, like acting, singing, dancing. If you just listen to the music, it's not going to be the same result. And then when you listen to the music after watching it, you'll be like, yeah, that's great. I honestly think that the new Aladdin is better than the old one. I would agree. I would say the new Aladdin is better than the old one. I would say the new Lion King sucks. The new Lion King was awful. It was a terrible movie. DPS, I want to see this meme. Can you, like, link it to us? Is that possible? Can you do that? Uh, he can't. He can't do it. Um, he could do it on Discord. If you drop Put it, it in Discord, Discord, I'll look at Discord. it. I'm also going to pee real quick. I was going to pee. Oh, wow. Can I go first? I guess. Yes. All right. Talk trash about me while I'm gone. Are we going to play more Mario Kart, or are we going to uh, move on to a different game? We can play whatever you want to play. Wow. Yeah, it's up to you. So we're just going to sneak one in that I think Alicia will think is hilarious. Go. Go, go. Yes, is uh, posting it in Discord. OSU says Disney stinks. I don't know if I agree with that. I think Disney's great. I think it's not fun to like not like Disney. You know what's bad? Hanna Barbera. Look at that. Look it up if you don't know what that is. Yogi Bear. Rocky and Bullwinkle. Awful. Man, this game is not loving me right now. Alright, we're going to do a Tom style. We sl slap the game. It's not working. Hold on. One more try on this one. Pins look good. It's still not popping up. All right, I guess we're just going to go back to what we were doing last night. Are you going to put Mario in there? No. We didn't get a different game to work, so we're going to play Smash. Smash it is. So, uh, while well, I pee, I'm going to set you up for a matchup. Great. Is everyone going to put um, So people, people that want to... The first three to respond to get their characters in the match. Um, it's a three-stock matchup. Being lonely sucks. I'm sorry. It's really hard. Um... Yeah. Actually, since you're playing, you're gonna do one. No, I don't want to. I'm not good. I can't. No, I have to go pee, so. No, but I can't play against computers. No, it'll be fine. This will be entertaining. Uh, Actually, we'll do one character. Yeah, just do one. I can't keep track of four. So it's we'll have hard. Donkey Kong play the, as the Donkey chat. San says DPS. So Link it says Eli. I'll be Link. I'll be Link. All right, pick Link. How do I, what do I even... 
Two. versus Donkey Kong. You're playing on the easiest skill level. Shoot. A or B? What is what? Press A and then press start. Start. And then uh, right. press over. And then press A. Hey. That should be good enough. Okay. Hey right, guys, you're about to see how awful I am at Smash. I just. What I'm doing here, I'm just gonna button smash. I think that's what it's called. Wow, but Donkey Kong is like not. Why am I not moving fast at all? I don't know. You wanna, wanna give me some chip, tips? Um, Matt, please show Alicia the Discord. He will. He'll show me. Uh, thanks so much for sharing that. I, I'm a big fan of Frozen and of memes. So that is great. Uh, anyway, earlier we had a little poll about my hair because I dyed it two days ago to dark brown. Oh, I just picked up a box and threw it. That feels like... How do I jump? Oh, I go up. Take the sword, take the sword, take the sword. Yes. Uh, I dyed it from blonde to dark brown. So I love to see what people are thinking. If you like the blonde or the brown better. The last time you saw me on Matt's channel, uh, Lumberjack Cracks, I was blonde. So just, you know, let a girl know. Uh, and I will look at the chat after I finish losing this game. Except he's... Ah! How do I jump? Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, no! 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 Oh, it's not good. Matt, I'm, I'm not doing well. But I asked people about my hair, so hopefully that'll make up for it. He's not even coming towards me though. Oh, like, I need to what am I? Drink. Yeah. Do you want my parry? I didn't even finish it. Like, I didn't even open it yet. I'll have that. That's what I was gonna go grab. Perfect. I can do this spinny sword thing. He's okay. not even fighting me. Like, That's you put your... this on the easy. <laughs> That's your upbeat. Matt, please show Alicia the Discord. Nobody voted on my hair yet. Oh okay. yeah, I'll, I'll do that right now. Cause there's a racy frozen meme. I Don't just... push me off. <sighs> oh, I just did some fire thing. Unless that wasn't me. I don't know if that was me. Eli says, do you think, Alicia, when I go to Chicago with my future girlfriend and play in a tournament, would could we all meet up? Yeah! Dude, I'd love to meet you and your future girlfriend in a tournament. Hobo Sucks 2 says, have you seen the Smash Bros. 64 remix ROM hack? <laughs> I saw, um... Oh, no, 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 no! I saw one that the uh, Project M people had posted on April 1st a long time ago, which seemed cool, but, um... No, I'm not familiar with this. Um, I should look it up. Alright, we're, um, we're looking at a meme... What is describe it to I, me first and then show it. Um, I don't know if that's actually a meme it. DPS that looks see. like cosplay. Yeah, that just looks like an animated picture. Like a drawn picture? No, that's a person. That is a person. I don't think that's a meme. I, think I don't think that's a, picture, a meme. I'm pretty sure that's just... Pornographic image. It's just bait. Have you seen the smash? Definitely not a meme, obviously. <laughs> <laughs> wow. All right, there you go. Well, yeah. All right, you won. I won, but it wasn't very fun because he didn't really do anything. Did you want to see if you could do better if they were a little bit better? No. <laughs> no, I can't. Totally can. Yeah, you want to see? Let's see how high of a computer. So this is what it usually starts off. But as. don't do like three stocks. Do like two. Two stock. Two stock. All right, cool. I will also buy my future GF an NHL jersey. I don't have an NHL jersey. So uh, if you can name a single NHL team, I'll Bruins. think about it. Ooh, wow. Bruins. Brings out Raptors. one of the original six. That's a basketball team. Just kidding. Bruins. Blackhawks. <laughs> what's new? Rangers. He could play as Ganondorf. That's awesome. I'm gonna look it up right now. Ugh, I feel so Take it easy, DPS. Hopefully, you have enough sleep to Thanks get it so through the GPS. day. so much, DPS. I hope that uh, you enjoy your frozen meme. <laughs> I hope that your frozen I meme your frozen brings meme you into the next day. You through the day, because I, I think that's what it's for. Just take a look at it. 
Um, I have no service. That's weird. Yeah. I just threw a box at him. What was I supposed to look up? Oh, Mario know. something. Smash Bros. 64 Remix. Hold on, I got something in my eye. Did you pause? Oh. I, oh, you're asking the computer not yes, to attack you? <laughs> DPS says, LOO, need more meme. <laughs> need more meme. <laughs> Don't take the heart! I want the heart! He took the heart, Matt. Uh, you listen to me. My heart's been stolen. My heart. You were up on him up oh, by one stock. Ah, oh, fuck, until now. You Sorry. seem to just be hitting B a lot. I don't know what the buttons do. I just press things. I mean, you're you're doing it against level three. But you're gonna get. You're gonna do it against the level five next. Here. Eli says I'm a Devils fan. Cause we're yeah, the devil. Yeah, but I did know a Bruins team. So does that mean I get a jersey? Uh, chat. I would like an input here. I won. Uh, if you think I should get a jersey, Bruins jersey. suck. <laughs> I, I spent a lot of time in Boston. Uh, so, I actually... My family is Devils, Rangers, Flyers, and Islanders. Are you familiar with any of those? Mm. <laughs> Rangers! How many of those teams are from New York? One. I'm wrong. Two? Two. The Islanders are from Long Island. It's not New York. <laughs> oh! <laughs> I mean, when you say New York, what are you, what are you talking about? New York. When oh, I'm God. here in the Midwest and I see New York, I just mean New York. Uh, nope. I don't say... That's New York State. You gotta say New York State. Yeah, that, that means New York here. All right, so not a thing. Alicia Islanders is from New York. I'm Eli's. Eli's getting mad at me. I'm sure the Islanders are from. Isil, uh, Islia. Alicia. 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 Alicia beat the level three computer, I so beat let's the level let's three. Can let's kick it up to level. Oh, we could switch, but I fine, I thought fine. it would be no, easier for you if you good. switch your color to periwinkle. Oh yes. Oh. I'm sorry, I did not mean to insult you, Eli. My Fili oh. Filipino mate Thomas has a Lakers jersey. Lakers. Lakers is dope. California? Yeah, LA. LA? There, there we go. I know things. If you could not tell, I know basically nothing about sports. I've learned a lot about football, though, recently. Just from playing tech ball. You know, you were a sideline reporter for Harvard. For soccer, not for, for football. <laughs> I was Actually, a I don't know how to talk about soccer, soccer, so that's that's funny. Maybe you can teach me something about soccer. What what do you uh, remember from soccer? I would just ask questions. So like, so take me through those last few minutes before you scored the game-winning goal. Congratulations on that. Such an exciting moment. Take me through what's going on in your head. On in your head. Uh, or. I know you fought really hard today. What do you think made the team come together to be able to beat Yale? So what you're I saying think. is you don't need to know anything about sports. I need to know anything about sports. To be a sideline reporter. Ask them interesting questions. So like uh, one time I did a track and field meet and I was like, so you just like beat your PR in that last run. How are you feeling right now? Knowing personal that? record for those that you're not following. Yes, personal record. Uh, and she gave me a big smile and gave me an awesome answer. So, it was great. Well, it sounds like you were really good at what you were doing. I was very And it really didn't matter them, that you didn't that know what you were talking about. I nothing about sports. I would ask, like, one time I accidentally, like, they were like, get this interview with this guy. He had just run, like, this crazy fast dash thing. Uh, so he was like, I was like, um, so, uh... What do you think is the most important thing when you're training for a meet like this? And he was like, <sighs> Well, I think, I think the most important thing is just the, the, the dedication. <laughs> and he was just dying. And they were like, Okay, sorry I made you do that. Next time, let's give him a minute to breathe. And I was like, That would probably be a good idea. I just died. It's fine. You know, you're doing pretty good against um, level five computer. 
Is that good? I feel like that's. I feel like you're just trying to make me feel better right now. Um, Eli says my mom Oops. and other cousins is a Rangers fan. I nice. also want to be a play-by-play -play commentator. <gasps> Very cool. I actually know a. I, so I worked for Harvard Athletics for a very long time in the video department. Um, and I videotaped games, I directed games, I did some sideline commentary, and I met a lot of play-by-play -play and color commentators. I actually know one who moved to Chicago and does games. So if you ever come to Chicago and need a job, I just want to just go. No, I was looking at... You were on your the, phone? I was looking at the thing that the chat told me to look at. So we got Dark Samus patch. I want to be with anyway. So uh, I know a play by play. So computer. Alicia can handle up the level five computer. Let's turn the difficulty up, and uh, we're gonna crank it up to seven now. I don't know if they like to watch me play this. No, I'm I'm curious. Let's go seven. Right. Alicia cranked up to seven. We're gonna go here at uh, Kirby's Ugh, Dream. This is not a good idea. The only thing that's taking me right now is because I'm Periwinkle. That's the only reason I'm winning. He's not even attacking me, Matt. Like, what does seven even mean? I mean, you're two under the hardest difficulty in the game. Oh, wow. That's not bad. But and, he's not uh, even trying to attack me. He looks like he has an intent to kill, though. He does look angry. <laughs> Scary guy. Hobo Sucks says, I hope they put Donkey Kong Jr. as a faster but weaker Echo Fighter as Donkey Kong in the Smash Bros. game. I missed the little guy. Yeah, that would be pretty cool if they brought back Donkey Kong Jr. Um, they've star, what does the star do, Matt? What basically, the star do? you're invincible right now. Nice. Can I not pick up fall? The, pick up the tomato. Ah! Hey, there you go. What Great. did that do? It took down all of your percentage. Nice. Yeah, it would be cool to see Donkey Kong Jr. again. They've basically abandoned him. I'm trying to remember what the last game that he was in. And uh, it, might be, it might be Mario Kart for the Super Nintendo. Um, but I think there's one after that, and I'm failing to remember. But anyway. Um, I just knocked him off the stage. Eli says, hole to Gretzky, looking to get past the Whoa, Bordeaux. How do I get up? How do I get up, Matt? Okay, I got it. Yeah, you got it. it. He has it. Oh. He scores. Wayne Gretzky scores the St. Louis Blues. Snorlax, no, no, no. Roderick no. Coleman says, my favorite animated Disney movies of all time is Frozen, sing-along edition. Brave Bambi. I've Bambi 2. Brave. The Black Cauldron, Melody of Black Time. Black Cauldron is awesome. Fun. I haven't seen, I haven't seen Black Cauldron. It one flopped at the, um, in the theater though. Um, Melody of Time, which I'm not familiar with. Fun and Fancy Free, also not familiar with. And The Adventures of Ichabod and Mr. Toad, also not familiar with that one. JC Jones says, "Hey, can you play StarCraft One or Counter Strike 1.6 on this channel? They're basically esports." Um. I mean, I would make the argument that we could. I would. Um, but. <laughs> All about pleasing the fans. Alicia doesn't care about anything. She'll no just idea. play whatever you ask. Whatever you ask me to play. Um, but yeah, I I mean, I think fighting games are sports. I think um, any esport game is a sport. I think yeah, first person shooters can be sports. But, you know, I that's like not what this thing. channel is focusing on. I have to scratch my head. Don't attack me. Okay. Alicia is holding her own against a level 7 a computer. She doesn't even know her abilities and just beat Donkey Kong. Just beat level Donkey 7. Kong. This, Tom would love it. The, uh, is that a real thing? The, uh, the thing I want to point out here is this is the first time Alicia's ever played Super Smash Brothers on the 64. Yeah. Able to beat a level... Seven computer, is that, which is, is that good? very impressive. Oh, thank you. Um, means a lot to me. Now we're gonna put you on the hardest difficulty. Oh, I don't know how I feel about that. And see how you do. We're gonna p bump it up to three stocks, though. We need to watch those animated. Cause um, I mean, I was struggling against level nine. I need a fellow can line mate. UWU. What does that mean? Canine? 
I can't. What's my... What are you reading? I need a fellow cane line. Canine. Canine. Wait. Ooh. -woo. Ooh. -woo. You know? Sorry, if you see me touching my eye Midwest, my contacts are freaking out. Midwest Furry Fest. That's all I'm going to say to Eli. I'm sure there's a furry fest near you. Um, Roderick Coleman says, you need to watch those two animated Disney movies. Alicia has Disney Plus. We can definitely do that. we can that. watch whatever we want. JC Jones Great. says, Tom would love it. Yeah, he would. I mean, he got confused when I played Harry Potter and was kind he of He wasn't upset. confused. He didn't like him. He was, he was mad. He was clear with the fact that he was not a fan. But you know what? It's a sports game and he can suck game. it. Uh, Roderick Coleman says, what's your favorite M-rated games of all time? You and your girlfriend. Um, it's hard to... <laughs> I mean, Alicia doesn't know that. Know. I don't think she's even played an M-rated game. I don't think I have. Just say Grand Theft Auto San Andreas. No, I'm not going to say that. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'd say is Resident Evil an M-rated game? Yeah. Resident Evil. I'm going to also go with Resident Evil. Resident oh, Evil is so. fantastic. Read that. Other ah! Um, Hobo Sucks says Mario Tennis 64. Though he was in Mario Kart Double oh, Dash as a cameo, he is originally planned as a Donkey Kong's cart partner and found in the beta files. He is a Koopa, <laughs> Koopa, <laughs> in, <laughs> Koopa Kid in the early Mario Party of the DK crew. I do remember that now that you mention it. Um, that was the one that I was failing to remember. I have the Japanese saber. version of that game. I don't have the American version because it is like 20 bucks cheaper to buy it in Japanese instead. I have a huge and it's still the same game. <laughs> What's your girlfriend's favorite T-rated game of all time? Sims! <laughs> she played Sims. Played the Sims. Is that, that rated that's, T? That's right? before we dated, so... Oh, I tried to Yeah, that is rated T, so yes. you're right. Uh, no, I would say, um, what was that game? Like, with that, Pat, that tech, that's not rated T, but it was a really fun game. Vet tech? Is this like a PC Vet game? Tech two? Yeah, it was a PC game. Give me my lightsaber back! Roger Coleman says, I love The Sims. Thank you. I also really enjoyed playing The Sims. Eli says, I like says, to build the houses. Mario really Krat. <laughs> What's Mario Kart? Is I don't know. It sounds like what you would call Mario Kart, Mario Kart? in, uh, in uh, New Jersey. <laughs> the Mario Kart. Mario Kart. Hobo Sucks says, uh, my favorite adult game is the Doom series. <laughs> I don't know if it's an adult game. If you said Duke Nukem, I would game. find that acceptable, but that's also still not adult. <laughs> not Doom. Hmm. Roderick Coleman says, I love to build houses on The Sims. It's the best part, and decorating them, so fun. No, and the best. The, people. the best part of Sims is when you put. Oh, I fell off! I fell off! How do I get up? 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 Okay. Um. Is when you put them in a ladder and delete the ladder. <laughs> or put them in a pool and delete the ladder. Basically. Yeah. You take eight, eight Sims and see mm -hmm. who survives the longest. You yeah, you right. get rid of the door. You get rid of the toilets. <laughs> you make them cook in a kitchen that's definitely gonna set something on fire. Nice. And you see who lives. That's the best. Star oh, Hobo me. Hobo Suck says Doom oh, is rated just... R here in Australia. Oh that makes sense. You're from Australia. That is the coolest thing. I've always wanted to go to Australia. But uh, you know, work. I mean, you guys didn't even get Left for Dead Two, as far as I'm. Concern. I think you might have gotten a version of it, but like, yeah, Australia does some. They're they're tough. They're tough with their games. <laughs> That's... He's not even smashing me. He's just smashing the air. About Chickabella. Wow. <laughs> Why is he doing this? Uh, Roger Coleman says, "What is your girlfriend and yours favorite E-rated game of all time?" Ooh. Zoo Tycoon. <laughs> <laughs> All PC games I played when I was like nine years old. Ah! It's okay. You are tied with him. On the hardest difficulty in this game. You're Bring actually doing really well. 
I'm just pressing buttons. He took my I know, lightsaber. but for you just pressing buttons, holding your own on the hardest difficulty. I didn't. Really I don't even good. think it's that difficult. Like I feel like he's not even trying against me. Like he's a computer. Like well, obviously we're, playing someone else. We're not playing out. Smash Ultimate. We're playing the first of these games. Uh, I would also say my favorite game. E. What is Kingdom Hearts? Raven. Uh, I think it's E plus ten. So Great. So, e. yeah, Kingdom Hearts is probably my favorite. I just want that. And you still haven't finished it yet, but you know. Hobo Suck says Australia is a bit pussy shit sometimes. Not all of us like our gun laws, for example. Yeah. How's the brush fires going? That's what I want <laughs> to help with. Yeah. I want to go to Australia. I just and, um, thought about that. that. Are you I safe? I would date a Del Fox or Lucario or Glaceon. That those are all. Cool. Those are all Pokemon. I don't know. They, they sound pretty cool. I mean, I like Glaceon. Um, out of all the out of all the evolutions, I would say Glaceon might be the sexiest. So. I would say Espeon. 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 Mm. I like the purple. It's a pretty casual answer. Why? <laughs> Are you tagging you my, know, my Jolteon would be pretty intense, you know. Nah, Jolteon's trying too hard. Your favorite's Vaporeon, but you would go with Espeon, Espeon as the sexiest. Espeon, yeah. Espeon is like, so chill. Like, All sleek. Right. You know All what right, I mean? Cool. If you have 11 favorite games in any rating. 11 favorite 11, games? 11, that's, that's for Matt. <laughs> that's a lot of games. It's a question for I'm Matt. I'm going to read off of my shelf right now. Um, Sonic Mega Collection. 007 Nightfire. Mario Tennis. Mario Party 4. Leatherheads, Indiana Jones and the Crystal. Oh, we're going, we're going to the wrong thing. Um, Madden 13, Sonic All Star Racing Transform, Skylanders, Super Mario 3D World, Legend of Zelda: Breath of the Wild, Mario Kart 8, You're Super not, Smash Brothers Wii U, in, NES Remix Pack. Is this in order? No, I'm just reading off the shelf. Okay, That's what I said that. I was doing. Uh, all evolution. <laughs> what does Uwu Owo mean? Ooh, ooh. Oh, well. Eli, what? Er, Eli, Eli. <laughs> he likes Eli. them all. That's all he's saying. Oh. You don't have a favorite? What's your, like, favorite to use? Because my favorite to use is definitely Vaporeon. All right. We're going to try this one oh. thing since we're talking about Pokemon. Oh, let's try it. Let's see if it works again. Very excited. <sighs> we if should, you blow in it, that's how you We should it. wrap this stream up soon. How long have we been streaming for? For a long time. For a really long time. Alright. It worked! It worked! <sighs> Alicia has never played this game never before. Is this, this the right controller? This is the right controller. Great. Now I watch the on, screen. Don't look at that. Look at the screen. Jack and Beans. <laughs> hey, it's Todd. It's, it's literally Todd. Yeah, you recognize that pretty quickly. Of course I did. I'm He's impressed. the only one with the camera. Who is it? You don't know who that is? Is it new? <laughs> it is. I wasn't... I didn't know Todd was going to get a picture of you. Is this like a story game? Because I'm very excited if it is. It has some vague story. Nice. We'll probably only go through a couple wow, levels of this. Wow, it is almost four o'clock in the morning. Yeah, we'll, we'll do like we'll do like that's, one or two levels of this, and then we'll call it a night. Pokemon Snap. Press start. Just go to continue. New, oh, continue. You'll erase the old one. It's Professor Oak. So go to go Are to course. Are you going to take Pokemon pictures? Good luck, Tommy. <laughs> Press A to do it. Also oh. noted on there, Tom put his name in his Tommy for this game. Tommy. He got this the day this game came mm -hmm. out at Toys R Us. So think about what year this game came out, and that's how old Tom was, and he decided his name was Tommy. Tommy, it is. So go to the beach. What a sunny beach. It looks great. I should get there some awesome shots there. Do you want to say it in Tom's voice? 
What a sunny beach. It looks great. I should get some awesome shots there. Pretty good. High score. Zombie dust on tap. Demon tap. 643680 643680 I'm supposed to get 1,510,000 Stop reading that. <laughs> what are you doing? I don't know. Read the comments. There are a lot of comments. Well, read them aloud while I do whatever I'm I doing. I like Jolteon. I should save or Porion too. What do I do, Matt? What do I do? Double sex. I'm glad uh, real life Am sports fans apples? appreciate Mario doing? sports games. Mario sports games are in, among my favorite sports games. Hold Z. Z? What's Z? Oh, right. And this is how you take pictures of Pokemon. Okay. So you want to get them in the center. Ah! But you don't have to do that the whole time. Oh, you got. Look at you. You're taking pictures of Butterfree. Um, yeah, Mario sports games are fantastic. If you look back at the Late Night with Lumberjack Cracks channel um, playlist, I have played through all the Mario sports games on GameCube. So if you want to see those. Oh, he didn't. He didn't see his face because it didn't count. What? Um, this is really hard to control. Well, you're learning. Eli the Wolf says, "Remember from Nintendo 64th Power Snap XXX and Crystal and Star." Whoa, buddy. <laughs> what? Don't worry about it. Total Almost sucks his ah time. childhood. Oh, give me a sword. This is supposed to be an easy game. Hold R. Hold R? What's R? This one? Oh, that's the wrong one. That makes you go faster. Ah! I thought it stopped you. What if I just keep pressing A? Well, you're just wasting your film. How much film? Oh, I do have a limit. This is so hard. King is gone. <laughs> so how are you feeling right now, you you and your pokey buds? Um, they don't like me very much. They don't want to see you. They don't want to see me. They're not even facing you. It's really sad. <gasps> oh! Oh, Get over here! One thing that makes me really happy is Bowser and Peach have been just chugging just away this chugging whole away. time. chugging away! Yo, stop! <laughs> Female so, Pokemon in Legion wow, of Doom, like with Hawk and Animal? What? Legion of Doom. Wrestling. How many pictures? I didn't get very many points. You took five Pokemon pictures. That's it. Pokey pictures. Pokey pictures. Hey, I got 128,000. That's not too bad. Um, what? So now you can pick which pictures you want to show to Professor Oak. How do I do that? Because you might not be proud of those. Wow. Okay. What's this? this is kind of odd. I don't know. What do I do? I mean, none of these seem very great so far. Wow. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm coming at you. You're coming at me. I don't know. Eh. That's a picture of a butterfree. What do I? That do? doesn't look a butterfree to me. It's a it's a picture of a lot of different Pokemon. I don't know what to do. Oh no, I didn't mean to do that. Oh. Just press B. <laughs> then go to to Professor Oak down at the bottom. Hit yeah. Let's see what he thinks of your <laughs> Let's picture. See what he thinks of that picture. What's new this time? Press A. Oh, it's already there. Oh, up, size is it's down. Not very good. If it were a larger shot, how do I oh, do the, that? Oh, the the pose. Oh, that's what shot he got last time. There was no way I was getting something like that. <laughs> Press A to save. save there you go. This is not. Actually, all right, so we saw one level of Pokemon Snap. 
I think it was yeah, fun enough. That was good enough for me. Let's uh finish out on right. Pokemon Stadium Two. Yes. Give me this. I'll set you up. Do you want to battle me, or do you want to battle against the computer? I'm going to battle you. All right, we'll do it. No, nope, not what that one. What do you think about it, Alicia? About my new series, The Legion of Doom. What do I think about The Legion of Doom? Hold on. Hold on. You want to do anything goes? Anything yeah, goes. Yeah, anything goes. Free battle. Anything goes. I thought I was blue. Um, so I'm going to select my Pokemon first, and then you get to select. And I get to see what you're selecting? Yeah. Nice. You get to see what I'm selecting. How many do you get to choose from? Uh, all of the ones up to second generation. Interesting. So, Very cool. Do you want to pick, um... I'm going to get my boy Porygon Z here. Or Porygon course, 2, I mean. Of course, of course. Yeah, of course. Um, Let's be real. Scizor. One of my boys. Let's slap a Pikachu up in here. Um, these are in alphabetical order, apparently. Uh, we're going to slap a Kadabra in there. Maybe a Jolteon. A lot of electrics, a normal bug. Um, and my last one I'm going to go with is Ivysaur. Mm -hmm. Okay. okay. Yes. Now go to go over to rental only. Okay. Hit, hit the button up here. Sorry. This is one of those games. That's, hold, the, hold the controller like this. Oh, hold it the normal way. Yeah, the way that... Will you tell <laughs> me what I think about Legion of Doom? All right. So you had a Kadabra. So, oh, wait. I'm using the wrong one. Okay. Do I grab Let's the last cider? But you got a lot of elect electrics in there, so we're going to stick a Blastoise in. So you can get fucking destroyed by my electric types. Oh, Very good fuck. Idea. Sorry. Well, you already selected them, no, so... No, how do I go back? You can't. Well, you have a Ivysaur, so... Yeah, it's fine. But that's... Also, <laughs> you have a norm. I don't know. I don't even. I don't even. Just select your Pokemon. For this crap. Did you say you too young for this I crap? I said I'm too drunk for this crap. I need like a ooh a Charizard. Yeah. All right, Blastoise, Charizard. And pretty standard selection so far. Well, you're pretty standard. <laughs> All uh, right. I definitely want to get ooh a Dragonite. I'm just starting to forget what you picked already. It doesn't matter. It's real bad. I'll put a Dragonite in there. I'd like to get like a fighting or something. A fighting or up a in ghost, here. Like a ghost? What do we got? Then you can go down get to an G Espeon? and get Gengar. Oh, <gasps> grab Espeon. Yeah, that sounds good. I do like Espeon. Uh, what about Gengar? Over, I'm looking over for there? Gengar? You just passed him? Ah, there he is. I'm a big Gengar fan. I'm gonna fan. go grab the last of the deciders. I have. I don't know. You took mine. I took it. The Legion of Doom is basically a series about me and Anthro Pokemon I like in the Militia, also known as the Legion of Doom, and my car is a Corvette CF. C5. That looks awesome. I'm. That sounds cool. That sounds very cool. I'm only in the G's, and I already have almost... Let's get, like, a, a Hitmonchan. Why not? So... so what kind of moves... <laughs> does like hit one chan have in this game uh, don't worry about it just pick them i only got to the h h's okay you Sounds have all good. fully evolved pokemon i awesome. don't great that's what it's about alicia and what do you think about it uh i mean it sounds cool right yeah why not is it like a... So now you're picking the order of your Pokemon that are okay. come out. Okay, do you go first or do I go first? We both pick. We don't It's ran, or We don't get to see what's happening, the... so don't worry about it. Okay, so you just select. Okay. Yeah, select. Wow. 
My uh, my lineup versus yours. <laughs> Shit. Looks pretty bad. Uh, we're gonna open with that one, and then honestly, the rest of them don't matter because you're just gonna. Your starter is the only one that really matters. I think. I don't. I don't even know if I did it right. No, well, just hit the rest of the honest. buttons. Just slide your finger across. We're... I did. I did. I thought I did. Okay, we're good. Press A. Oh, I wasn't pressing the right All right, button. this is how we're going to finish up the stream. The we're going really late. In camo. Yeah, it is 4 o'clock. Oh, shit. Opens with Kadabra. Yeah, I'm not ready for this, I think. If I, but honestly, I don't know what I... Kadabra oh, versus Espeon. I, I did not select that. Apparently did. So, how do so I... press A to battle, and okay. then hold R to check your moves, and then hit the corresponding C button. See. Yellow button. Yeah. Let's do... So, yep, that's how that's gonna go. Alright, alright. Why does Kadabra have thunder? Oh, she's not doing so well. It doesn't matter if he, why he has Kadabra. Why he has Kadabra punch, Kadabra punch, Kadabra punch, Kadabra punch. he just does. Yeah. Boobs, Espeon. <laughs> so real. Espeon is the cutest. Even though I'm the only male and the Pokemons are females. That's I always a, assume all my Pokemon are female. That's a that's a harem. It is a harem. Uh, Alicia guess... used to watch a lot of harems when she was a kid. What? What are you I don't know what this one is. Isn't that what Spice and Wolf was? Oh, sorry. What was it called? Fruits Basket. I love Fruits Basket. It's not a harem. There's like one female character and a bunch of dudes. I mean, one dude and a bunch of female characters. No. Fruits Basket is literally the opposite. Oh, so it's a verse harem. Yes. <laughs> strawberry sundae from... What does that say? Macca's? From Macca's, which is McDonald's oh. in... Uh, Australia. I never had a strawberry sundae from McDonald's. Oh, this is so rough. You know, McDonald's does their thing with their ice cream. It's available. It's right there for you. McFlurries. Mm -hmm. You've never had a McFlurry? I'm not sure I have. No, oh, it doesn't matter. Maybe when I was, like, really young. I mean, it tastes like Oreo ice cream. How do I... You've had Oreo ice cream. How do I select? You like it. Oh. Now, th that's why it did matter. Whatever your first Pokemon was, the only one. Okay. Really well, I didn't even select my first Pokemon. Uh, Roderick Coleman says, What is y'all's favorite anime fan service TV show of all time? Ooh. Um, So, fan service is like. It's literally like, hey, we're going to have sex in here for some reason. What? <laughs> Huh? Uh, so Gengar really wasn't the best choice for this. He's weak to uh, psychic because he is poison and ghost. You're obliterating me. Yeah, you know. Um, fan service, fan service anime. Um, it's not necessarily a fan service anime, but there the reason why I started watching the show was because I thought it was fan service. There's a show called Nana. Which is a, a show about two girls that moved to Tokyo at the same time. And I thought they were going to fall in love with each other. But it's actually a band anime. And I love band animes. Um, band animes. And it's, it's, a, it's a shoujo that is really good. It has a very good storyline. And it focuses on music. And it also focuses on drama. And uh, drama is Oh, At least it's dropping a oh, piece that. Um, oh no, I don't know what I selected. I might have selected what I wanted and I might have not. You know, tuxes are good. Yes. Um. Oh, they actually put strawberries in it? Wow, that's crazy. Hmm. 
it's it has fan service even though it's not anime you need you need more anime if you're gonna have fan service anime is what it's about uh, I would say my favorite uh, anime I mean in general fruit basket probably has fan service in it Fan service is basically when characters will just obnoxiously, like, they'll lean over and, like, oh. their cleavage will show and just, like, but, like, a straight fan service anime. There's one, I can't remember the name of it, but it's literally a sports anime about this sport where women fight with their butts. Do you remember that one that we were, that was on when we were at the boiler room? Um, so that's called Kill a Kill. Um, that one is that there's fan service in that, but it's it's also like a parody of making fun of like how obnoxiously was... like. But at the same time, you know they're still making a show you about are... like chicks that are not wearing any clothes. <sighs> yeah, I'm still on my first poke. I know you are. I'm on my fourth. I know you are, but what am I? Mm -hmm. But um, I also like, uh, oh, what's it called? School Rumble, I think it's called, right? Yeah, it was the one we discovered. Really like that one. That one definitely has some fan service, I would say. I feel like I'm pressing the wrong buttons. <laughs> like I just don't. I've never played this game before, so. Have no idea. It's what fine. Buttons. It's just justifying my ability in Pokemon if yeah. I win this. So well, you are more able in Pokemon. You have more experience than I do. I just have a lot of experience points. I'm like a yeah. level eighty is a hundred, and you're like a level. Oh I, God, three. I beat Sword. <laughs> mean. Oh, Is Kadabra, he his spoon hit his head. <laughs> Sad boy. Who I don't have anybody to counter Blastoise. I mean, Charizard. It's like, you have a Blastoise? <laughs> I love School Rumble! Yes. Nice. High School nice. of the Dead. Yeah, we need to get you on more anime, you know? We do. We totally do. We got Porygon 2 up in here. If I make it. Oh, I did. Wing attack. Oof. Oof. Not enough. Sorry, nah. sorry. Nah. Um, for those of you who are still watching, if you could do me a hard favor, uh, subscribe to late night with lumberjack cracks channel if you guys are not already subscribed to that that's where i'll actually be playing non-sports games right now we're just we're just embellishing here on the retro sports gamer channel after a harry potter stream which uh the channel host my brother tom he uh he was confused by that he didn't like it he didn't he didn't even understand where i pulled this one out of but you know what it exists and we did it we did do it. It was fun. I liked it. It was, it was a good game, surprisingly. It was all right. <laughs> no, anyway. You won a game. I did win a game. I don't game. know why you're upset. Yes. Have you all seen Black Lagoon? Um, that was one that I had put on my list and I didn't end up watching. I know it's like a late 90s... Uh, fan servicey kind of anime it's got guns in it pew pew. pew pew eli says as you know we see we didn't do a movie even darker though it's full action that, that's not what that says i can't can't read hobo sucks as i remember seeing nadia tight african tushi in nadia secret of the blue water tasty even... not familiar with that one Did you just pick a move that doesn't do anything? 
I don't know. I'm, I don't know the moves in this game, so I don't know what does stuff and what doesn't do stuff. Mm. Do you know what I mean? Sure. That's enough, Blastoise. Come back. That's enough, Blastoise. That's enough from you. <laughs> Oops. Sorry. I passed on Hitmonchan that. coming out to round out yeah. this... Uh, He's coming back. This is where he's going to Dynamax and then apparently come <laughs> back in the battle. Yes, that's great. I love that. <sighs> Alicia, tired of this. Ma'am, what is your favorite action anime TV show of all time? Action Sailor anime Moon. TV. Yeah, that's a, f yep. that's a fair one. Yeah. Um, Action, I would uh, I would go with you, Hakusho. That's a good one. Not very effective. Love it. Um, yeah, that's my guttural response. So, yeah, Yu Hakusho. Yeah. Yeah. Roderick Coleman agrees. Yes, Sailor Moon is the best. It is! I grew up on Sailor Moon. I love that. So good. And I go on. Yes, it is. It's super effective. How much oh. about to pull, pull one out of the bag? For wow. Me. It's throwing in a bag. Oh. Oh. Oh, no, you still have four <laughs> I have one. Did you press the wrong button? I did. Is it Cesar? They're making a new Sailor Moon, says Roger Coleman. Oh, yeah, they are making a Strictly 90s asks, why aren't you Ow! using your personal oh. channel? Um, we just... I just... It cracked my head. We started playing Harry Potter bit. at the top of the stream, and then, uh... Since we've been drinking, we just, uh, devolved into playing whatever we feel like. But yep. honestly, I feel like Pokemon is a sport. Um, so... so uh, fight me. Don't fight me. Uh, but I wanted to play uh, Breath of the Wild. On my channel. On Matt's channel. And Alicia asked a question. How does everybody feel about her playing? Oh, that was forever Instead ago. Instead of me playing. Well, no, no, no. So here are the three options. There's I play Breath of the Wild. It's fully paralyzed. Matt plays Breath of the Wild, or we both play Breath of the Wild and, like, compare and contrast playing. Uh, when I play Breath of the Wild, I fall a lot and catch on fire and do lots of fun exploration-type things. So here is the question directed directly at you. What is the best to not the best? So worst, or the best movie to the worst Harry Potter movie. Ooh, okay, of the movies. Does it include Fantastic Beasts? I haven't seen Fantastic Beasts. Oh, Fantastic. so then it doesn't. So no, that's not a Harry Potter movie. That's. I mean, it is, but it's not like it's like if I'm. It's, there's no. I can't even attack. <laughs> did you do Lear just to be nice to me? No, I just did it on accident. No. Uh, okay, so my favorite movie. So my favorite book is definitely the third one. My favorite movie, I would have to say, is also the third one? So let's start there. Let's start at the favorite. It's either the third one or... No, I would say my favorite movie is definitely the third one. Um, I'm just a big, serious black fan. Yes, you can add Fantastic Beasts. Okay, I have actually not seen Fantastic Beasts. Uh, I am not going to lie. I've only seen the first one. Dad. Was, did the second one come out yet? I don't... I think so. I don't know. Um, we have a lot of information. So, yeah, I'm going to go with the third one for the first. And then I'm going to say probably the fifth. Because when I first saw it, I was very, very confused. And I was like, this is a really dark movie. Like, just visually dark. It was hard for me to watch. Um, but I, it really grew on me. So I would say it goes third movie, 
fifth movie, sixth movie, fourth movie. So we're at third, fifth, sixth, fourth, first. No. Third, fifth, sixth, fourth, seven, part one, first, seven, part two, second. That's what I would go with. I'm really glad if anybody can anybody follow keep that. track of that. But apparently seven, part two is the worst one, which is the last one. No, seven, part one. Oh, that's the worst one? No, two. Okay, so two is the... It's just, I didn't really like the second one that much. Um... Why did I realize that? <laughs> I would say seven part two, or sorry, seven part one is my second to least favorite just because it doesn't really get that. I mean, it's good. Um, I really appreciate a lot of moments in there. I think they don't add up to the most interesting movie. Um, have y'all seen the extended version of the first Harry Potter movie? I haven't seen Harry Potter since I saw it in the theaters. I didn't know there was an extended version. I have it on DVD, but I, I don't think my oh, DVD has... we're just going to have to get that Blu-ray set. We're going to have to get the Blu-ray set. I don't think my DVD has the... um. Seven Part 2 is the worst one a little bit. It's hard. Um, I like Seven Part 2. Again... For the same reasons that I like 7 Part 1, I feel like it has really great moments, but when you add it all together, it's just not the best complete movie. Um, that's how I feel about both of the 7s. Like, for example, the last scene in 7 Part 1 is absolutely stunning, and I don't want to ruin it for anyone, but it's beautiful. But basically the I first mean, don't hour... Don't ruin it for me, because I'll throw a bottle at you. You just like to move. Uh, the, like, middle hour of seven part one is just rough. It's the just fourth rough. Harry Potter movie is the best Harry Potter movie ever. I, I won't fight that. I've seen that I movie won't fight it. the most out of all of them. I've also only seen up to the fourth one. Oh, um, that's just sad. That one is really good, but the reason I saw it the most was because when I worked at AT&T in uh, Oak Brook, they had TVs on the wall. Just kill me and I'm that movie would be on all the time. And I, I knew a lot of that movie. Yeah, and luckily, my brain's great at repressing things, so I don't remember. I do like the fourth one. It is it is pretty good. Uh, stop using Lear. You're driving me crazy. You're just torturing me. You're just torturing me. Um... I just really like the third one because the, the chapter in the third book that's like the the rat I don't even remember. It's no, it's With, like um, um Mooney, Wormtail, Padfoot and Prongs, I think is the name of the actual chapter. Uh, yeah, it, yeah, it is. Mooney, Wormtail, Padfoot and that, Prongs. That rings a bell in my brain, so I'm pretty sure you're right. But that could not be the name of the chapter. It could be like the rat, the dog. I don't know. I forget. But that's my favorite chapter in all of the Harry Potter I books. I remember learning just about excellent. Peter Pettigrew and him being the rat. And, yeah. and then Ron just felt felt sad after that. Yeah, it was. What is the best to worst bad Star Wars movie? <laughs> that's actually interesting. We're um, watching the Star we're Wars in, movies. We're in the middle of determining that. Yeah, so I'm not exactly um, sure. I'm not going to give you that answer because I'm going to trigger the hell out of you because we've only watched we've... the original trilogy recently. And, uh, um, and they're not. I'll trigger. They're not good. The original they're trilogy not. is not as good as a lot of people say. They're just not good. Um, so, uh, can you stop using Lear, please? Yeah, I can. Um, yeah, they're just pretty, pretty bad. I would say out of the original trilogy, the fifth one is probably my favorite, followed by the sixth, and then the fourth. What would you say? What? Out of the original trilogy. Rate them. Um, six is the worst. Six is um, the worst? Fourth isn't the worst for you? No. Six is way worse. It's just not coherent. 
And it's it's, but it has the, it's, Ewoks. A, it's a big action figure fest. But it has the Ewoks yes. fucking suck. They're so cute. I don't care how cute they are. It's garbage. Alright. 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 Fine. Why I like the trilogy Star Wars movie a tiny bit. <laughs> Have you heard Dune? It's heavily influenced Star Wars. Um, Dune, I've heard of it. No, I have not watched it. Finally, you are going to. It's okay. It's okay. Just dragging this one out, aren't you? Um. Yeah. I just think. Stop. You are just. You, you torture. What am I doing? You just took Pikachu out. Oh, did I knock? Did I knock Pikachu out? Maybe. I'm not even paying. No, I did not. Oh, it's super effective? My attack. You literally took Pikachu out for Bulbasaur. Or for Agasaur. Um, and you just did it again, didn't you? Uh, <laughs> just you're being annoying. I pressed, like, three buttons that time. Um, for the original trilogy, uh... I just, the acting, the sets, the added CGI, it's just, it's not. Well, that's, that's the problem. There's not an easy, accessible way of watching those movies without what George Lucas decided to add in 1998 before episode one, which all of the CGI in those movies is as bad as the CGI in episode one. Um, with, which is oh. honestly the only reason that the original uh, or episode one is so terrible is because of the aliens yeah. and the horrible CGI. It's pretty bad. If you took Jar Jar Binks out of that movie and you took all the aliens out of that movie, you'd have a bunch of good actors in the same movie together, and it might actually be pretty good. Didn't even select anything. Apparently, you did. Um, I will definitely watch your series, Legion of Doom. We'll watch it together. It'll be great. It was a novel back in the 60s before it was Star Wars. Dude. Yeah, I mean, uh, that's what me and my mom were talking about like a oh, week ago. Finally. When okay. after I watched the original trilogy. Mm -hmm. So, uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed that. Uh, uh, best to worst. worst um, so. More movies. We've only watched a few recently, so that yeah. I, I think we can speak on. The first um, three, and then also, are we counting? I, I choose, choose you. you. How did you feel about it? So, is if I choose you I better? If counting I choose you, I would have to say I choose you is my favorite. I choose you is your favorite. I, I think I have to, yeah. I mean, it was just so good. I, I cried. Yeah, it was I, a good movie. I was sobbing. You did cry during Pokemon first movie, I too. did. No, you... No, I cried. You cried during the first movie. We were also movie. playing a drinking game, and I think I was the only one playing, so... Yeah. And also, um, I think I got cork in the wine bottle at the time when we did that. I think you did. And you were like, I'm not going to drink wine with cork in it. I'm like, I don't care. You were like, I'll drink it. I'll drink oh. anything. Ash, are you gonna be okay? Uh, <laughs> so I definitely, uh, if you have not seen, I choose you. So you should definitely watch what it. What we have in our pool That's is uh, Pokemon first movie, two thousand yeah, third movie, and, and I, I choose, choose you. you. Um, I would go first movie. Okay, fair. Um, your next. Choice. I choose you. Okay. Third movie. Yeah. And then 2000. 2000 is garbage. 2000 is so third, bad. Third movie is good. It's good. It's good. I Choose You is a fantastic retelling without the characters that you love. Yeah. And the first movie is sacred and does not need to be touched, even though they made a remake coming on Netflix in February. Yeah. So. Uh, Roderick Coleman also likes I Choose You. I would have to say... The one with Lucario in it, I haven't seen, Eli, um, so I can't vouch for that. I love Lucario as a Pokemon, um, as a mm -hmm. playable one is for my team, and also just as a design and whatever. It's, it's a great Pokemon. Mm -hmm. um, I'd have to say, I choose you. 
third. I gotta put the third before the first. Wow. It's just it's so There good. was a moment where in that movie where I Alicia screamed. screamed. I literally and screamed. It was the middle of the night. It was it was probably one o'clock Whole, in the morning. She screamed, holy fucking shit <laughs> at the top of her lungs. When should I say it? Is that okay? I, mean, I don't wanna ruin it. I don't wanna ruin it. You could just say it. It doesn't matter. It's when Charizard saves Ash when he's falling. And I just freaked. Freaked out. It was a good moment. Or wait, can we count Detective Pikachu in the Pokemon movies? Um. Because uh, didn't. If and you, the live action movie, yeah. So if you want to count Detective Pikachu, mm. which we've seen a bunch. Seen a lot. I'm, uh. I can't. Live action movies are not comparable to animated movies. It's I'm hard. not gonna do it. It's really hard. I'll um, do it. It's. <sighs> I would... I'd have to. I I'd put Detective Pikachu first. I would put it after Pokemon first movie. Okay. And then That's I fair. choose you. I'd say Detective Pikachu. I choose you, Pokemon. I will. Ugh. I'm willing to admit that my decision is probably based it's off nostalgia. Of nostalgia. It's based off of nostalgia because I think the third movie is a stronger movie than the first movie. And then 2000 because 2000 is just it's rough. Uh, favorite female superhero. Hmm. Wow, you're hitting her right on the nose right when we're trying to end. I know. <laughs> it's okay though. Uh, favorite female superhero. You can just keep answering them. I'm just going to play a game. You play. Um, uh, superhero. So, uh, what, like, do I have to stay within a certain universe, or? You can do whatever you whatever. want. It just says favorite superhero, female. My favorite, oh, I easily. Know. Okay, I know. I'm gonna say I know. mine. Uh, yeah, I want to go first. Mine is Kitty Pride from X Men. Oh. Okay. Um, if you read the uh, Astonishing X Men, she's a fantastic character, um, written by Joss Whedon in that one, and uh, he did Buffy, Buffy the Vampire Slayer in the original Avengers movie. He knows how to d do strong female leads and uh, ensemble casts, and uh, yeah. Yeah. She's uh she's fantastic. Also, I think she can defeat any superhero because she has the best defense and offense. And if you want to make an she argument, she can't defeat my superhero. Uh, my okay. favorite is Captain Marvel wow. because I am a huge Brie Larson fan. Um, I I I really like her. Um, she's a very strong actor. I just I. I really liked the movie. Um, I like her story. I think she's an interesting character. So I would have to go with Captain Marvel. And she can be basically anyone. So, yeah. So let me make an argument how... My um, favorite female superhero is Rouge from X-Men. Kitty Pride can defeat any superhero. Because mm -hmm. you don't know what her ability is. Do you, you know don't. What her What's her ability? Is? So her ability is to become, like, she phases. So basically, um, a solid object can go directly through her, and she can decide to be solid whenever she wants to be solid. So essentially, what a person that does that can do is the perfect defense blocks anything, and mm -hmm. then she can literally put anything in your brain, decide to be solid, that's in your brain, you're dead. She can't be defeated. But she would never catch up to Captain Marvel. I, I mean, they were just... She could stay on solid the entire time they would be fighting. Right. And then if she ever got close to her, drop something in her brain and kill her. I don't think she'd ever get close to her, though. I don't think she'd and kill her. I think she would <laughs> but... let her guard down and Captain Marvel would just like... <laughs> her. You know what I mean? I don't like Captain Marvel that much. Ooh, Captain Marvel is an okay female superhero. My favorite female superhero is Storm and She-Hulk and Batgirl. Uh, I also she she's kind of a lawyer. She's that's she's, a movie coming soon. Oh, I think you would like that one. 
I have one that's kind of an anti-hero, and that is uh, Catwoman, just because she's kind of cool. I guess she's more of a villain. Right, so, like, she be, real quick. Yeah. What other Pokemon in Anto form in should be in a Legion of Doom? Um, Matt, what other Pokemon in Anthro form should be in the Legion of Doom? He left. I don't know. Uh. Hmm. What are the criteria? So, like, what what are you looking for? I guess. Um, what is your favorite female super villains? Oh, uh, man. Favorite female super villains. Female super villains. I don't even know. That's a hard one for me. Um, because I don't know. I want to kind of turn that question back around and ask what your f favorite female super villains are. Um, because I don't know. Honestly, I don't know. Uh, what other Pokemon in other form should be in the Legion of Doom? I would say, so are you sticking to like a certain, um, like, uh, what is the word that I'm like, I'm sorry, I'm so tired, I can't even think. Um, but basically, are you looking to stick to a certain, like, number of Pokemon, I guess? Uh, I can't remember what the word is that I'm looking for, but like, for example, I don't know. Ah, uh, Smat, he's coming back. So when he says Anthroform Pokemon, could that be any Pokemon? Is that, what does that mean? Oh, the computer's playing... Mr. Mindball right yes. now. Yes. Wow, they, are they just going on their own? Or no, I this think game it's a not replay. end yet. Oh, you played. No, I I picked all the computers. Oh no, I think it's a replay. Uh also Roderick asked what is our favorite female super villains? I did not have an answer for that. Um So super villains. I can't think of any big boss ones, but I think Polaris is really cool from X-Men. Uh, she's the daughter of Magneto. Oh, you know who's really cool? What's her name? Thor's sister, what's her name? Oh. What's her? Oh, man. Why can't I remember this? Does anybody remember her name, Thor's sister? And Thor Ragnarok was my favorite out of all the Thor movies. Um, too. but that was a very she was a very cool head something. Head. Hella. Hella. Hella? Maybe. Helena. I don't know. She was sick. Was like she was super cool. The computer just got a death. <laughs> like that was just. <laughs> Cool. Hella, I think it is. Hella, I think that is right. Uh, but like, so when he says Pokemon in Anthro form, what does that mean? Um, I'm assuming that just means like in uh, some type of like humanoid form or like. Oh, cool. Anime, or um, uh, what do you call it? Like animal human form. Right. Okay. Uh, so for. Actually, from the most recent game, I'm a big Score Bunny fan. So I would say, like, Score Bunny reboot Cinderace. Yeah, I mean... Really like that evolution line. Yeah, that, those are Very all fantastic cool. Pokemon. They're great. Um, but um, yeah, anyway. I think we're getting at the end of this we're one We're getting at the here. end, seeing as it's um, 4.30 in the morning. It's 4.30. We've been going for two hours. It's been um, a long time. So final thoughts on Harry Potter... Yes. World Cup Quidditch Quidditch World Cup. I liked it. I'm excited to unlock the different aspects of it. So what you're saying is you'd be willing to play it. Again. Oh, Enchantress. Okay, okay. Oh, so we're Oh, yeah, I didn't even think about. Harley Quinn, Emma Frost. Emma Frost is a kind of an anti-hero though. Cuz Emma Frost in um Hello, yep. Yeah, that's that was right. In uh Astonishing X-Men. Yeah. Which I was referring to earlier. Um She's a part of the team in that one. Lady Deathstroke, or Deathstrike, Poison Ivy, Talia, AI, Gull, Hella. Yeah, Hella, that's what Hella. we were talking about. 
Yep. Which is very cool. Um, Legion of Doom will be great, Eli. I'm the sure. music genre is metal, jazz, in some moments. That sounds Love it. very interesting. Metal and jazz sounds... <laughs> metal and jazz sounds like an amazing combination. It sounds great. <laughs> Love it, Eli. Legion of Doom. Hope to see it to yeah. its fruition. Uh, if you would like to place a vote, because I don't think anyone did, right, about who should play Breath of the Wild? <laughs> I think that... Ooh, we missed Teddy Belcher's. What? Well, back. Teddy Belcher, 4K oh, no. Ultra Wide, 21 by 9. My live action helicopter goes out to soy, 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 soy. Soy, soy, soy. Um, anyway, we will answer this last question and then uh, go to sleep. So, um, favorite rapper? Uh, Mike Shinoda of Linkin Park. If we are counting, you know, we are going to count her. <laughs> Lizzo. I'm a big Lizzo fan. You know, you're counting Lizzo as a yes, rapper? Yes. Yes, I am counting Lizzo as a rapper. Because no, I think she counts. No man on the Minnesota Vikings. New man on the Minnesota New Vikings. Men? New man on the Minnesota he said, "No man on the Minnesota Vikings." No man on the Minnesota no, it's Vikings. No man on the Minnesota Vikings. I guess I'm the trainer for all of them. Um, big pizza fan too. I mean, pizza? everybody loves pizza. Loves pizza. Hang loose, bro. Um, um. <laughs> yeah, I would count Lizzo as my as a, a favorite rapper of mine. Come on, Other that's than... a fucking cop out. Give an actual answer. It is not. Mike Shinoda was a joke answer for me, but also I love Mike oh, Shinoda. Well, Roderick loves Lizzo too, and <laughs> Lizzo has classified herself as a rapper many times. Uh, um, I mean, if you said Missy Elliott, which is actually a rapper, that would have meant shut something. Up. Shut up. Uh, I don't even know, but yeah, I really like Lizzo. I count her as a rapper. I think she is. If you would like to you know, cast, Sh Shouty says she wants to look the rapper. If you would like to cast a vote in the poll of who should play <laughs> Zelda Breath of the Wild, please comment. On the Lumberjack Cracks channel. On the Lumberjack Cracks channel, so Roderick comment. Roderick Coleman, I don't know if you've subscribed to the Lumberjack Cracks channel. So subscribe. If you have not done that, please yep. do that. That's where we will actually like play the non-sports games. Yes. You might see more of Alicia. You might. We might. This is my first time on the Retro Sports Gamer channel. Just other than other the than weird the times I'm at Demon and the family tournament. Uh, but, um, yeah. but yeah, comment uh, on the last Mario video on the Lumberjacks Crack Lumberjack Cracks <laughs> channel. LJC channel. LJC the channel. The is we have to say the whole thing. Lumberjack Cracks because that's the handle. Comment. I wish it could just be LJC, but, but no one that would, would not it. be that easy not be to. Okay. It's not personal enough. Um, no. Anyway, comment no. and tell us who you would like to see play Breath of the Wild. LJC. Please. Alicia. A L I C I A. I think that Once was again. LJC. Woo. <laughs> Only one vote. Alicia. A L I C I A. You can even put Ali. You Papa can put John's Alista. You can put whatever you want to. <laughs> Uh, lumberjack cracket, <laughs> lumberjacket of the cracket. That's pretty awesome. Anyway, I think we are about ready, right? We're about we're ready to end off. this one. Uh, Thank I, you so much for tuning I'm in. I'm glad all of you have stuck around for as long as you have. Yeah, this is amazing. I appreciate it. It's been really fun tonight, yeah, and uh, a good time. you know, remember to subscribe and like to both this channel and the Lumberjack channel. You know, Cracks just channel. because people on YouTube say that all the time, you don't have to say it right I'm now. I'm going to say it because people should subscribe and like and share. I am definitely going to share this video. Oh, you boy. You should, too. Your future employer <laughs> would love to promotion. see this video. <laughs> all right. It's going to be. True. All right. Well, thank you guys so much. Say good night, Matt. Good night, everybody. And uh, ta-ta for now.